and your son has been born. Wait, I've been born. Oh, you're so cute. I'm so excited to be your mommy. Oh, uh, mom, what is that noise? Skibbity Toilet is attacking the city. We gotta go. Skibbity Toilet, who is that? He's that guy in the tank. We gotta get to the bunker fast. I'm going to destroy Toilet City once and for all. Oh my gosh, mom, run. Wait, get down here. Confused. That would be close one, mom. Are we in the bunker now? Yes, we're in the bunker. We will be safe here. Oh, all right, good, mom. But how are we gonna get rid of him? Well, when you're older, you're gonna have to train, and one day you'll be able to defeat him. What? I'm gonna have to train? Oh, man. Well, mom, trust me. I'll become the strongest Titan TV man ever. And I will defeat Skippy Toilet. Yep, I know you will. Well, let me show you around the bunker. Oh, all right, mom. Let's start out with the guns. If Skippy Toilet comes down here, just get a gun and shoot him. Oh, all right, mom. Well, what else is there in this bunker? Well, over here is a jail where we will put Skippy Toilet if we catch him. Oh, yeah. We gotta put Skippy Toilet in here. And whoa, is this an interrogation room? Yeah, it sure is. You're a smart baby. Yeah, I know, mom. Well, where's my bedroom? Because I'm getting super duper tired. Well, up here is your bedroom. Whoa, this is my bedroom right here? Whoa, there's literally so many beds. Yep, you can choose any bed that you want. Really? All right, thanks a lot, Mom. Well, I'm gonna go in this bed. I'm gonna head to bed because I'm super duper sleepy. Okay, good night, Titan TV man. Uh, good night, Mom. Uh, good morning, world. Today is gonna be such an amazing day. And good morning, Mom. Whoa, you're benching so much on there. Yeah, I know. I'm just training to defeat Skibbity Toilet. Yeah, I can tell you're benching 500 pounds. Holy mackerel. All right, Mom. Well, what are we gonna be doing today? Well, today we're gonna be starting your first day of training. Wait, what? We're gonna start my first day of training today? Yes, sir. That's awesome, Mom. Well, what are we gonna start out with? We're gonna start out with... Hello, are you in there? Wait a second, Mom. Who was that? Uh, I'm not sure. I'm just gonna grab a gun just in case. All right, Mom. Yeah, I'll grab a gun, too. Oh, my gosh. Hopefully, it's not just giving me a toilet person or anything. Come outside. Uh, hello. Who is it? Mom, who's at the door? Uh, I don't know. There's a skibbity toilet tank outside, though. Oh, man. This is bad, Mom. What are we gonna do? Well, it doesn't seem like anyone is in the car, so let's go over and investigate. But be cautious. Oh, all right, Mom. Let's see. Wait a second. Mom, look at the top. There's a guy at the gun area. <laughs> I'm Skibbity Toilet's minion. Hey, what are you doing here? I am here to kill you. Wait, what? You're here to kill us? Mom, do something. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> you can't get me. Boy, he's dodging all of your bullets, Mom. Hey, stand still. No, I won't stand still. Or take this. Ow. Oh, Skibbity Toilet minion, stop. Get away from my mom. Oh, take that. <laughs> Yes, sir, I defeated Skippy Toilet's minion. But wait a second, uh, Mom, are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. He just took me down. Oh, all right, good, Mom. Well, is this Skippy Toilet minion alive? Oh, oh, my gosh, she's back up. Oh, Skippy Toilet, stand right there. No, I don't think I will stay here. Ha, ha, ha. And Skippy Toilet will be back soon. Just you wait. We are going to take over Toilet City. Oh, no, you're Get back here. Oh, my gosh, Mom. He literally just ran away, and he said, Skippy Toilet's are going to take over Toilet City? Uh-oh, that does not sound good. Yeah, it sure doesn't, Mom. This is super duper bad. Bad. Yeah, it sure is, but you know what that means? It's time to start training. What? It's time to start training, Mom? All right, well, what are we going to be doing first? We're going to go to the campsite, and then we'll see. Oh, all right, Mom, let's go. Here we are, son, and first we're going to work on training our punches. Oh, all right, Mom, and wait a second. What are we going to be doing after that? Then we're going to learn how to use your powers. What? Learn how to use my powers? All right, I can't wait. So, Mom, how do I train my punches? Just copy what I do. All right, so I have to do this, and uh, Mom, it is literally not working. Come on, Titan TV man. You just got to put one fist in front of the other and hit. What? One fist in front of the other. Huh? All right, Mom. Well, I'll try that. Let me put one fist in front of the other. And whoa, Mom, look at me go. Yeah, you're doing it. Yeah, I sure am, Mom. And I'm going to use this to defeat Skibbity Toilet. Yes, you sure are. And now we're going to work on your agility. What, my agility? Okay. Well, what even is agility? Agility is the way to move quick and easy. So we're going to test it out on this tightrope. What, on this tightrope right here? Are you serious? Yep, I'm serious. Walk down really, really fast. Whoa, Mom, you're pro of that. Okay, here, let me try. I'm just going to walk down. Ouch! Uh, Titan TV man, just keep on trying. You'll be able to do it perfectly soon. Really, Mom? Do you think so? All right. Well, here, I'm going to try going up this time. So I'm just going to hop on right here. And, oh, my gosh. Oh, man. I just slipped off. Well, I'm going to keep on trying, Mom, and hopefully I can make up soon. So come on, come on. And Mom, I'm almost at the top. Yes, sir. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, TV man. One more time. You got this. Oh, all right, Mom. Well, here, let me go up, and I'm going to go super slow and steady. And now I'm going to run. And yes, sir, I made it. Yes, I knew you could do it. Hey, what are you guys doing here? We're training to defeat Skippy Toilet. Oh, really? We'll see about that, huh? 
take that. Oh, you're going down. Ow, ow, ow. You're hitting me pretty good. Well, uh, I'm going to hit you. Come on. Ow, ow, ow. Hi, uh, police. Give me Joel. You're so weak. Oh, wow, oh, wow. Oh. I don't feel so good. Oh. Yes, Mom. I defeated police. Give me toilet. Yeah, you sure did. Thank you for teaching me how to punch Mom in. Wait a second. He's back up. I got to get out of here. But Skibbity Toilet will be back to destroy the city. Oh, my gosh. He literally just ran away. He's such a scaredy cat. Yeah, you heard him. But he said Skibbity Toilet's going to be back to destroy the whole entire city. Oh, yeah. He sure did say that, Mom. So we're going to have to keep on turning him. Wait a second. Can he teach me my special move now? Sure, I can. And this is the most useful move move out of all of them. This will defeat Skibbity Toilet. What? This move's gonna defeat Skibbity Toilet? Yep, it sure will, and I will demonstrate. Three, two, one, go. Ah! Oh my gosh, Mom, that hurts you very bad. Yeah, I know. Though that was only 1% of my power, because I did not want to hurt you. Wait, what? That was 1%? Well, what does 100% feel like? Well, 100% will literally destroy Skibbity Toilet. What? It will literally destroy them? No way, Mom. Yeah, sure. We'll just wait until you use it on his final fight. Uh, all right, Mom. I cannot wait to use that on him. Well, now can he teach it to me? Here you go, son. I'll teach you how to use it. All right, Mom. Well, what do I even do? Well, you just want to walk up to them and then scream at them. Uh, all right. Here, let me try it. <laughs> uh, son, you need a better scream like... Yeah! What is current like? <laughs> Wait a second, oh, Mom, are we all right? Uh, sorry, son, you're just so powerful. Wait, what? I'm actually powerful, Mom? Yeah, you are. I honestly think you're gonna beat Skibbity Toilet. What, really, Mom? All right, well, where even is Skibbity Toilet? I don't know, but this has been enough training today. Let's go home. Well, we're just going home. Oh, all right, Mom. Well, hopefully Skibbity Toilet comes to our house so I can defeat him. Hey, Mom, we're back home, but why does this guy look like that all of a sudden? Whoa, it is time to destroy this city once and for all. Wait a second. Mom, Skibbity Toilet is right here. And I'm going to be starting with the Titan TV family. Oh, no. Get inside. Run, Mom. Get inside fast. Oh, I'm going to destroy your house. Oh, no, Mom. This is bad. Grabbing weapons fast. And we have to defeat Skibbity Toilet now. Yeah, we do, but he's shooting at us. Come on out, guys. Don't be scared. I brought backup. Whoa, Mom. Look. There's literally so many army cars right there. Oh, no. This is bad. We got to go fight him. Yeah, we do, Mom. Well, let's go. Oh, oh. Skibbity Toilet, you're going down, Mom. I'm I'm gonna use my special power. No, son, let me go first. Wait, mom, no. <laughs> uh, mom, no. Give me toilet, you're going down. No, you're going down, Titan TV man. Look it over here. <laughs> It seems like you missed. Give me till you're good at my nerves. It seems like you missed again. Nice try. Oh, give me till trust me, you're going down this time. No, I'm not. Get over here. Wait, what? Oh, get away from me, Shibby Toilet. Oh, you're going down. Wait a second. I have you in the open now. Oh, take this. Oh. Yes, I defeated Skibby Toilet, but wait a second, Mom. Oh, my gosh. Are you all right? Uh, son, I don't feel good. Get me to the hospital fast. All right, Mom. Yeah, we got to get to the hospital super duper fast. You're going to be all right. Trust me. I'm really in a lot of pain. Hurry. I'm hurrying, Mom. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Doctor. Please help my mom. She's dying. All right, hurry. Get back here. All right, Mr. Doctor. Mom, trust me. You're going to be all right. We have the doctor now. All right, so what happened to her? She got shot by Skibbity Toilet's cannon like five times. Oh, no. Are you serious? Skibbity Toilet is here. Well, he's not anymore. I literally just defeated him. What? You defeated Skibbity Toilet? He hasn't been defeated in years. Well, okay. Let me get my tools. Okay. Okay, you're gonna be all right, Titan TV woman. Don't you worry. Come on, Mom. You got this. Son, I think it's over. I'm so proud of you. Wait, what? No, Mom. Don't die. Oh, Titan TV man, I'm sorry for your loss. No! Uh, this TV channel is so boring. I really wish Black Street for 24 hours was on, but it's not today. And I'm literally so bored. There's nothing fun going on. I'm just gonna get up and I'm gonna go downstairs and get something to eat. And uh, let's see, what do I have to eat? And oh my gosh, I have bananas. Yes, sir. I love bananas so much. But wait a second, bro. Are you serious? The banana is literally raw. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it right now. My whole day is trash. Wait a second. What the heck? TV woman literally just sent me a Snapchat? No way. Oh my gosh. Gosh, guys, maybe this is my chance at her dating me while here. Let me see. And it says, Skippy Girls Only Sleepover. Wait a second. What the heck? Guys, they're literally having a Skippy Girls Only Sleepover without me. Oh my gosh. You know what? I think I figured out a way to cure my boredom for the day. What I'm going to do is go over to TV Woman's house. And I'm going to go to their sleepover. And hopefully, I can actually get inside. Because I'm so bored right now. And maybe when I'm inside there, I can get her to date me while here. Let me off my car real quick. And I'm going to head over to her house right here. And oh my God. 
garage. I can't believe it, so I'm just gonna go up here to the front door. And wait a second, guys, look up there. They're literally both the Skippy Girl, Speaker Woman Girl, and TV Woman. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. And I'm gonna knock on the door. Uh, hello, knock, knock. Is anyone home? Oh my gosh, Speaker Woman, who's knocking at the door? I don't know, let's see. Uh, hey there, Skippy Girls. Uh, Speaker Man, what are you doing here? Oh, well, I saw your Snapchat that you sent me, and I was kind of wondering if I could join your Skippy Girls only sleepover. Uh, Speaker Man, this is a Skippy Girls only sleepover. No boys are allowed. Yeah, we're serious. Did you not read the text? Yeah, I literally just sent you a snap that says no boys are allowed. Wait a second, you did? Oh my gosh, here, let me check my phone real quick. And no boys allowed, bro. Are you serious right now? Come on, guys. Can you make an exception, please? I'm so bored today. The only way we can make an exception is if you were a girl. And you're not a girl, so good day. Wait, what? Guys, hey, let me in. Oh my gosh. They just shut the door in my face. Are you kidding me? See you later, speaker man. Yeah, see you, speaker woman. Guys, I cannot believe this right now. TV woman just said the only way that I can get inside of the Skipper Girls only sleepover is if I became a girl. And I'm not a girl. I'm literally a man. Well, you know what? Honestly, I think I'm gonna give up. Wait in a second. She said if I become a girl, I could get into the sleepover. So what if I dress up as a girl? I sneak into the Skippy Girls only sleepover. Oh my goodness. That is such a great idea. Well, huh. Well, first I think I need to change some clothes and after that I gotta put on a wig because I literally got like no hair right now. Well, here, let me think. Where can I get some clothes in a wait a second? There's literally a girl's clothing store and then there's a hairdresser right next to it. What am I even thinking? Well, you know what? I'm gonna head there right now. And I'm gonna buy some girl clothes so I can sneak into the Skippy Girls only sleepover. And perfect, guys. I made it to the chick clothing store. And this clothing store is literally for girls only, so I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna get some girl clothes. So, hey there, missies. I have a question for you. Uh, aren't you a man? This is a girl's only clothing store. I mean, yeah, I am a man, but I need some girl's clothing. Uh, okay, that's a little strange, but what are you looking for? Well, preferably girl pajamas. Oh, pajamas? We have a whole section. Follow me. Wait, really? Uh, alright. After I get these pajamas, I gotta do my hair right across the street over here. And then I can sneak into the girls always oh, sleep over. This is gonna be insane. And here we are. You can try on anything that you would like. Oh my gosh. Alright, thanks a lot missus. And guys, now I'm gonna try on some pajamas. And let's see what ones make me look like a girl. And here's my first set of pajamas. And wait a second. What the heck? This is literally a chicken onesie. Oh my gosh. You look so hilarious. Bro, what? No, I do not look hilarious. I mean, okay, actually yeah, I do look super duper hilarious. Well, you know what? Let me find some actual good looking girl pajamas so I can sneak into that sleepover. All right, here, let me change real quick. And perfect. Oh my goodness. This looks like something a girl would wear. No way. It's literally like a pink piggy with a heart. Okay. Well, Mrs. I would like to buy this, please. Oh, those look fabulous, honey. Yeah, I know what they do. Okay, well, this will be 50 bucks. 50 bucks? Are you serious? Oh my gosh. All right. Well, here, let me scan my credit card real quick. You know, all right. Thank you. No, thank you. Have a great day. Yep, you too. And guys, now that I have my pink piggy pajamas, I can go to the hairdresser and get my hair done. And after that, I'm going to sneak into the Skippy Girls Only Sleepover. It's going to be so crazy. So here, let me go to the hair salon real quick. And I'm going to get my hair done. Oh, hey there, cute piggy. Welcome to my hair salon. Uh, hey. I was wondering if I can get my hair done. Of course you can. Wait, really? It was that easy? Uh, all right. Uh, yeah, as long as you're paying me. Yep, I'll be paying you. Okay, well, little piggy, come and sit in this chair right here. All right, missus. And what do you want to do to your hair today, darling? Uh, I would like a blonde wig, please. Oh, okay. We have many blonde wig options, so I'll show you a few. All right, yeah, perfect. Okay, and here's the first option. Wait a second. This is the first option, honestly? Yeah. I'm that bad. You know what? I'll actually take this. Oh, wow. That was really quick. Yeah, I know. Well, come over to this counter and pay me. All right, yeah. Here you go, missus. Okay, thank you so much. Have a great day. Yep, you too. And guys, now that I have my blonde wig on, I can sneak into the Skippy Girls Only Sleepover. And I can try to get TV Woman to date me. So I'm going to head back to my car real quick and I'm going to drive over to her house right now. And I made it to their house, so guys, now that I'm dressed up as a Skippy Girl, hopefully I can actually get inside now and that wasn't a waste. Well, here, knock, knock, knock. Hello, Skippy Girls. Are you home? Oh my gosh, that better not be Speaker Man at the door again. I'm literally going to be so mad. Oh my gosh, they're coming down right now. Uh, hey. Hey there, girls. Uh, girl, who is this? Um, yeah, who are you? Uh, hey there, girlies. I'm new around here. Uh, I'm Speaker Woman Girl. Speaker Woman Girl? Uh, no, I'm Speaker Woman. Oh, I, I, I'm in Speaker Man Girl. I'm a sister. Oh, you're Speaker Man's sister. Okay. Well, it seems like you are a girl, so you know what? You can come into our sleepover. Wait, what? Real? I mean, wait, what? Really? No way. Yeah, girl, of course. Welcome to our town. Yeah, thanks a lot. Well, girlies, uh, can you show me around your house and uh, what are we 
can you even do tonight? Well, I was thinking that we could play a lot of games tonight and we could have some frappuccinos. Wait a second. Play a lot of games tonight and have frappuccinos? Uh, okay, that sounds slay. Period, girl. Well, look at this frappuccino. Oh, this is literally so delicious. Oh my gosh, yeah, that sure does look delicious. Here, can I have a sip? Uh, yeah, girl, you can have a sip because you're a girl. All right, yum, yum, yum. Oh my gosh, that frappuccino is slaying. Well, skibbity girlies, how about we start playing our first game? Wait, what? We're playing the first game right now? Uh, all right, girly. Yay, this is going to be so much fun. We should play truth or dare. Hold on. Truth or dare? No way. It <laughs> sounds like so much fun. Yeah, it totally does. I'm so down. All right. Well, uh, how about let's go sit down on the couch and let's start. All right. Yeah, let's do this, girlies. Well, girlies, who wants to go first for truth or dare? Huh, I think speaker woman should go first. What? I should go first? Uh, no. I, I don't really want to go first. What? But you got chosen. You have to. Yeah, come on, girl. Truth or dare? Uh, okay. I guess I'll go first then. I I'm gonna go for a truth. Wait a second. You're gonna go for a truth? No way. TV woman, what should we make her tell the truth about? I don't know, girl. I think you should choose because you're new. Bro, what? Are you serious? Okay. Wait a second. I got a great idea. Okay. Speaker woman, you're not ready for this. Uh, yes, I am. Give me it. Well, is it true that you like frappuccinos? Oh my gosh. Yes, I love frappuccinos. That is true. Oh my gosh. This game is so much fun. I, I want to go next. Pick me. Okay, okay. Yeah, you can go next. And guys, these truths and dares are gonna get even more insane. Oh, my gosh. I'm so excited. Well, uh, TV woman, truth or dare? I choose dare. Wait a second. A dare? Oh, my gosh. Okay, okay. Speaker woman, we have to choose the best dare ever. All right, yeah. Let's choose the best dare. Well, what is it going to be, speaker girl, man? Well, I think for a dare, we should make her dance on the table. Oh, my gosh. That would literally be so embarrassing, and I could snap it to all my friends. Okay, yeah. TV woman, you have to dance on the table. Oh, my gosh. What? No, that's so bad. Nope, you have to dance on the table. You're not allowed to back out. Yeah, we're gonna get Snapchats of you. Oh my gosh, no, that's not fair. Yes, it is fair. Now get to dancing. Yeah, come on. Oh my gosh, say cheese to my followers. Okay, I'll dance for you. And look at me go. Boogie, boogie, boogie. Oh my gosh, you look so ridiculous. I'm gonna put her on bar filter. Oh my gosh, what? No, that's so rude, girl. Oh my gosh, TV woman, you look so hilarious. Hey guys, I'm gonna post this to my story. Yeah, I'm gonna send it to everyone all also. No, don't send it to everyone, speaker woman. Haha, <laughs> I already did it. I'm done with that dare. All right, girly, but wait a second. Um, Speaker Man just posted on his story. Wait a second, uh, he did? Wait, why is Speaker Man posting on his story? Oh my gosh, guys. I forgot that I had them added. I'm not actually a girl. Oh no. Hopefully they don't get suspicious of me. I have to delete my story fast. Oh my gosh, wait a second. Look at his story. Why is his sister posting on his story of you dancing on the table? Oh my gosh, why? Why did you post it on his Snapchat? Oh, uh, uh, Guys, I can explain a uh, share account. Oh, that makes more sense. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, I was getting scared for a second. I thought Speaker Man snuck into our girls' only sleepover. No, no, no. He would never do that. Oh, my gosh, guys. That was way too close. Okay. Hopefully, I do not get exposed for sneaking into your wall here. Let me check the Snapchat real quick. And, ha, <laughs> she's dancing on the table. Ha, <laughs> ha, that was so funny. All right, guys. Well, it's my turn now. All right, Speaker Girl Man. Truth or dare? Huh, truth or dare? I want to dare. Oh, my gosh, girl. You're so rebellious. Yes. Yeah, I know, girl. All right, speaker man, girl. I dare you to sing. Wait a second. You want me to sing? Uh, My voice isn't good. Trust. No, girl. I believe in you. You can sing. Bro, what are you serious? Oh, my gosh. I've never singed in my life. Well, guys, what song should I sing? How about you sing Barbie Girl? Wait a second. Barbie Girl by Barbie? Oh, my goodness. Okay, okay. Well, guys, I guess I'll sing that. I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. Oh, my gosh. You Made suck plastic. at singing. It is fantastic. Oh my gosh, my ears are literally bleeding. Wait, what guys? Are you serious? Please put that micro down, please. Yeah, never sing ever again. That was literally so horrible. Bro, what? Oh my gosh, all right. Yeah, you're just not cut out for singing. Sorry. Yeah, see, I literally told you guys. Well, it's not my turn anymore. It's your speaker woman. So truth or dare. Okay, I choose a dare. Oh my gosh, she chose a dare. Oh my gosh, girl, I have the most perfect dare ever. But hold on, let me go get it. Wait, what? You're getting something? Uh, all right. Speaker woman, what do you think it's gonna be? Uh, I'm not really sure. Hopefully, it's not anything bad. Yeah, that would be super duper crazy. Okay, speaker woman, I dare you to eat this whole jar of baby food. Uh, that is literally so disgusting. Oh yeah. my gosh, eat it. I'm gonna Snapchat it. Oh my 
gosh, I can't back down from a dare, so I guess I'm literally just gonna have to eat that. Give me it. Yep, and I'm gonna show all of our friends that you like baby food. Ow! Oh my gosh, I'm Snapchatting this right now. Say cheese. Oh my gosh, okay, I guess I'll start eating it. Oh! And oh my goodness, guys. I'm gonna send that to all of you. Ha <laughs> ha. Dude, this literally tastes so disgusting, guys. I do not want to eat this anymore. Well, girl, it's a dare. You gotta finish it all. What? Are you serious? Oh my gosh. Well, it seems like there's only one more bite left, so you know what? I'm just gonna eat it. Oh! I am never eating baby food ever again. Ha ha ha. That dare was so funny. Well, you know what, TV woman? I'm forcing you to do a dare. Oh, what? No, that's cheating. No, it's not cheating. You gave me a dare, so I'm gonna give you one. And you know what the dare is gonna be? Uh, what is it gonna be? It is going to be call your crush. Oh my gosh, no, I'm not doing that. Yeah, you have to call your crush. No way. Come on, don't be a scaredy baby. Oh, so it's the baby that just ate all the baby food. Oh, roasted. Hey, don't you dare ever say that ever again. You are not allowed to back down from a dare, so you have to do it. Come on, get on the couch. Ugh, this is so dumb. Oh, well, TV woman, you have to call your crush now. Ugh, oh, right, but you already know who it is, speaker woman. Yeah, I know who it is. But it's gonna be so funny because speaker woman girl is right here. Wait, uh, guys, what do you mean? Okay, but you know I have a crush on speaker man. Wait, what? You have a crush on speaker man? Uh, guys, I, I kind of have to pee. I'll be right back. Okay, speaker man girl. Oh my gosh, guys, she's literally calling me. And this isn't even the bathroom. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe it right now. I have to answer the phone. Uh, hey, hey there. Oh my gosh, girl, he answered the phone. Oh my gosh, say that you have a crush on him. Uh, speaker man, I, I have a crush on you. Wait, what? You have a crush on me? Oh my gosh, she's hung up. Wait a second. Why did I just hear Speaker Man talk in the other room? Wait a second. And that's not even the bathroom. Oh, guys, this is bad. I think this is caught on to me. Oh my gosh, wait a second. This is all adding up. You are Speaker Man. Oh, uh, uh, guys, no, no, no. I'm not Speaker Man. Trust. Take off that pajama right now. Hey, what the heck? Hey, give me that back. I paid $50 for that. Oh my gosh, it is. Man. I knew it was you, Speaker Man. You snuck into the girls' only sleepover. Uh oh, I've been caught. Bye. Get out of here. Oh my gosh, guys. I literally snuck into the Skippy Girls' only sleepover. That was crazy. Uh, good morning, world. Today is going to be so awesome. But to start out with my day, I'm going to go downstairs and get some food. Uh, TV man, my stomach hurts super bad. Wait a second. What? Is that my mom? Her stomach hurts super bad? Don't worry, Titan TV woman. You're going to be okay. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. This is bad. My mom's stomach hurts so bad. Uh, maybe I should go check in on them. Uh, hey, mom, why does your stomach hurt? Uh, I don't know, so, but guys, I think I'm about to throw up. All right, you're going to the bathroom. Oh, my gosh. This is bad, mom. Please be okay. Ugh, ew, that stinks so bad. Oh, that's so disgusting. Well, uh, are you okay? No, I think I should go to the hospital. Wait, what? Go to the hospital? All right, we're going to the hospital. Come on. Titan speaker, man, follow us. All right, Dad. Oh, my gosh. This is so bad. Hopefully, Mom's going to be all right. Quick, get in the car. All right, Dad. Hopefully, your mom's going to be all right. I don't know what's wrong with her. We're going to have to go see her at the hospital. Guys, come on. It's hurting so bad. Come on, Mom. Just hang in there. We're about to be in the hospital any second now. All right, we're here. Now, quick, bring your mom inside. All right, Mom, here. Get inside fast. Hey, doctor, quick. Please help my mom. She feels she would be sick right now. All right, do we know why she's feeling sick? No, we don't know why, but she was like throwing up and stuff, and her stomach super hurts. All right, well, let's go get a room. Come on, fast. All right, doctor, I'll be right behind you. Okay, let's go inside of this room, and mom will lay on that bed ASAP. Oh, okay, I don't feel good. Don't worry, lady. We're gonna run some tests on you. Oh, no, hopefully the results are gonna come back good, mom. So, Titan TV woman, when did this start happening? Uh, I don't know, probably this morning. All right, all right, let me take a look. Okay, let me listen to your heart. Okay, your heart sounds fine. Now, let me listen to your stomach. Wait a second. Why is there a heartbeat inside of your stomach? Wait, a heartbeat inside of your stomach, Mom? What? Do I have two hearts? Uh, I don't know. Here, uh, let me do an ultrasound real quick. Okay, so let me take a look and wait a second. What even is that thing? Doc, what do you see down there? It seems like it, it's a baby. Huh, a baby? Huh, a baby? Yeah, a baby. Uh, it seems like you're pregnant. No, no, no. This could not be right. Yep, I'm serious. You have a baby inside of your stomach. Holy mackerel, Mom. I'm gonna be a brother. Yes, that's awesome, Titan Speaker Man, but we don't have anything ready. Wait, we don't have anything? Anything ready? Well, uh, Dad can run to the store and get some stuff for you. No, Dad has to stay home with me. You gotta go by yourself, honey. What are you serious? Oh, my gosh, Mom. Here's a list of everything I need you to get. Uh, okay, Mom, let me see. What is on this list? All right, so I have to shop for new clothes for Mom and then shop.
shop for baby stuff. And the last one, I need to shop for some groceries. Uh, all right, Mom, I think I can do this. And after I'm done, I'll bring it back home. And hopefully, I'll have a baby brother by then. Yeah, hopefully you will. Well, your baby's actually going to be born in an hour, so I would probably get on it. Hey, yo, what? One hour? Are you kidding me? Oh, my gosh. Well, I gotta get this list done fast. Yep, you sure do. Oh, my gosh. All right. Well, what's the first thing on this list? Uh, let me see. So, first, I need to shop for some new clothes for Mom. So, um, where even is the clothing store? Let me see. Maybe it's right here. It says ice cream. Okay, well, I'm gonna go into the ice cream store, and maybe they sell some clothes here. Oh, uh, let me just go inside real fast, and, uh, hello there, Mr. Worker. Do you sell clothes here? Do I sell clothes here? Uh, I don't even know if this is in my ice cream shop. I just broke in here. Ice cream? What even is ice cream? It's the most tastiest thing in the world. What? The most tastiest thing in the world? Well, okay, can I maybe try some? Yeah, what flavor do you want? Uh, can I have this flavor right here, the rainbow one? Uh, yeah, I can give you the rainbow one. Uh, alright, thanks, and, uh, by the way, do you know where they sell clothes? Do I know where they sell clothes? Uh, I don't even know. What? Are you kidding me, kid? Can you maybe help me find the clothing store because my mom is pregnant right now and she really needs some clothes. Uh, okay, I can help you. Do you need clothes like me because I look so cool? Uh, yeah, maybe that will work. I don't really know. Well, here, show me where the clothing store is. Alright, follow me. Uh, okay, kid. Yeah, let's go to the clothing store. Well, we're at the clothing store now. Yeah, I know, kid. Well, we're even as a person. Oh, hello there, guys. Welcome to my clothing store. Uh, hey there, missus. I'm here to shop for some clothes for my mom. Do you have any girl clothes? Oh, yes, right here. If you look right here, we have all the girl clothes. Oh, look at me. I look fashionable. Oh, yeah, kid. You kind of do look fashionable. Here, uh, let me try some clothes on for my mom because she really needs some. Well, here, let me try to put it on in. Oh, my gosh. It doesn't even fit. Well, since they don't fit on you, I could try on the clothes for your mom if you want to. Wait, what? You'll try on the clothes for my mom? Uh, okay, yeah, sure. All right, so let me know how you like this. What? What even is that? Why would my mom wear those clothes? Well, I don't know. What clothes does she even want? I'm not really sure, dude. Well, Mrs., do you have any other clothes? Oh, uh, yes, yes, yes. If you want some cheaper clothes, because I guess you're poor, you can go over to this section. What? Are you serious? We're not poor. Well, uh, do you think your mom would like this outfit? Uh, honestly, that doesn't look that bad. Yeah, I guess she'll like that outfit. All right, then let's go get it for her. Okay, well, Mrs., how much is the outfit going to cost right here? Oh, that outfit would be six dollars. Six dollars? Or do you have any money? Uh, no, I don't have any money. Do you have any money? I only have ice cream cone. Well, guys, how are you supposed to pay? If you don't have any money, well, uh, I'm actually just going to leave. What, kid? You're running away? Okay, well, see you, lady. Hey, get back here. Catch us if you can. And, kid, I'm pretty sure my mom's going to love that clothes so much. Yeah, me too. It looks so awesome on me. It's going to look so awesome on her. Yeah, it sure will. Well, kid, I have one more thing on my list, so let's see what it is. And it says right here, I have to go grocery shopping for some groceries. All right, kid. And after that, we're going to have to head to the hospital because I think my mom's going to have the baby by then. Okay, let's go get groceries. Yeah, let's go do this, kid. And now we're at the grocery store, and kid, while we're here, I think we should shop for some baby stuff as well. All right, let's do it. Yeah, because my mom's going to have a baby soon. What do you think the baby would like to eat? Uh, maybe Doritos. What, Doritos? Are you serious? Okay, well, I'll just get some of these for the baby. Uh, and maybe they have some cards here or something. Let's see. Is there any cards here? And no. Uh, well, my mom is really going to need a card for the baby to push around. Wait a second. I can literally just get my mom a shopping cart for the baby. Yeah, that's a great idea. You can push the baby around in here. Yeah, I sure can. Well, let's go check out. Hello, missus. Can we buy the stuff? Oh, hello. Yes, you may. All right, we're buying Doritos, and we also want the shopping cart. Oh, I'm sorry. You cannot take the shopping cart. The store owns them. Uh, well, my mom is literally about to have a baby in, like, less than one hour now, and she's gonna have to push her out of the baby somehow, so I'm gonna take the shopping cart. Oh, well, if your mom's having a baby, why don't you buy her a stroller? Well, because we literally got no money, and we're just gonna get out of here. Bye! Hey, get back! Here. Wait a second, what are you doing? You're not allowed to steal, and I'm gonna teach you a lesson, so I'm gonna kidnap you. Wait, what? You're gonna kidnap me? You heard me right. Hey, kid, save me. Wait a second, where did that kid go with my mom's clothes? Are you serious? He just ran away. <laughs> this is what you get for stealing. But my mom's gonna give birth in a few minutes. I, I gotta get to the hospital. Too bad, kid. You're going into my secret dungeon. What, your secret dungeon? Oh my gosh, I won't be able to see my new baby brother ever. Shh, be quiet, kid. I don't care about your mom having a baby. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. I'm sorry, Mrs. What can I do to make it up to you? Just sit here and be quiet and don't move. Oh my gosh, this is bad. I always got kidnapped and my baby brother's gonna be born any minute now. Uh, I have to get out of here, but huh, what can I do? Let me think. Oh, uh, maybe I can distract her. Uh, hey, girl. Look over there. There's a rat on the ground. Ew, a rat? Yeah, a rat. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. I'm gonna get out of here. Hey, kid, where are you going? I was just joking. I love rats. Oh my gosh, she loves rats. I thought that would have worked. Well, girl, can I just roam around this area a little bit? Yeah, you can, but I'm gonna have my eye on you. Oh, uh, okay, girl. Girl, well, huh? Let me see. Well, there's a tunnel out there, but I don't want to go in there because I'll literally get shooted. Well, huh? Let me go in here. And there's a light right here, but wait a second. What if I turn off the light? Oh my gosh. Okay, here. Let me do that real fast. And wait. There is a secret exit down here. Okay, okay. I'm going to go down. And what is this? Oh my gosh. 
There's a little uh, security monitor right here. Okay, I'm gonna go on it. And what? See the girls right there? She's just dancing. I don't know why she's not following me while here. I think I can literally access the whole entire town's camera. Oh my gosh. Oh, I gotta figure out where my son is. Wait a second. Is that my dad? He's trying to find me? No way. Titan speaker, man. Where are you? Oh my gosh. My dad is literally looking for me. I'm kidnapped right now. Oh man. Hopefully he can find me. Oh no. Let me go to the grocery store and see if he's in here. Oh my gosh. My dad is literally going to the grocery store. Wait a second. What is the girl doing? She's literally outside of the place. She trapped me in and she's going inside of the grocery store with her gun. Oh, hello, sir. Welcome to the grocery store. Oh, uh, hey there. Have you seen my son anywhere? He was supposed to be here. Uh, no. I'm so sorry. I haven't. Are you sure you haven't seen him? Uh, he looks like a speaker. He's a uh, Titan speaker man. Uh, sorry, sir. No, I haven't seen him. Oh, my gosh. Well, my wife is having a baby and I really need him. So if you see me, uh, just let me know. Okay, sir. Don't worry. I will. And oh, my gosh. That girl just lied to my dad and boy. She's outside of the dungeon, so maybe I can escape now. Okay, here. Let me just hop out and let's see. Where can I even go in? Oh, wait. What? Are you serious? This place is locked. Oh, no. This is so bad. Well, wait a second. I'm literally a tiny speaker, man. What am I saying? I can literally make a speaker noise and my dad can find me. Okay, here. Let me do this. <sighs> Wait a second. Titan Speaker Man just made a noise. Speaker Man, I'm coming. Dad, save me. I'm in this dungeon. All right, don't worry, Titan Speaker Man. I'm coming in. All right, I'm inside of this room. Uh, where are you? I'm down here in this small room. All right, well, how do I help you? Dad, turn off the light. Turn off the light? Uh, okay, okay, okay. And yes, Titan Speaker Man. Dad, thank you so much for saving me. Yeah, no problem. Well, we have to get to the hospital fast. Your mom's having a baby. What? She's having it right now. Wait a second. Dad, this is the girl that kidnapped me. Hey, who? Who are you? I'm the grocery store worker, and you're not taking your son out of here. What? Why am I not taking him out of here? Because he stole from my store. Wait a second. You stole from her store? Yeah, Dad. I was trying to shop for the baby and Mom, but I didn't have any money. Look, I had to steal the shopping cart so Mom could put the baby in it, and I got some Doritos for the baby. Oh, Titan Speaker, man. I can't believe that you did that. You could have just asked me for some money. Well, uh, I'm sorry, Miss Lady. My son will never do that ever again. Now, could we please leave? No, you're not going anywhere, and if you do, you're going to get it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, okay, we'll just stay here. Don't worry. Dad, what are we gonna do? I don't know, Titan Speaker Man. Your mom is about to give birth to your brother. Well, uh, let me think. You have your speaker powers, right? Yeah, I do, Dad. All right, well, how about I use my TV powers and you use your speaker powers and we can knock her out? Wait a second. That's a great idea, Dad. Yeah, let's do it. And hey, girl, we have something to tell you. Oh, uh, what is it? You are going down. <sighs> Oh my god! Yes, Dad, we need to feed her now. We gotta go to the hospital fast. Mom's giving birth. Yeah, come on, quick, let's go see your brother. Yeah, let's do this, Dad. Hurry, tight speaker man, hop in the car fast. All right, Dad, yeah, now let's go to the hospital. Quick, get inside. Your mom's giving birth. All right, Dad, I'm going inside fast. Oh my gosh, I wonder what my baby brother looks like. Let's go see. Hello, Mom. Son, here's your new baby brother. Oh, uh, Mom, why does he look like that? Uh, I don't know. He's just special. Oh, okay. Uh, hey there, baby brother. Go, 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 go. Oh, look how cute you are, son. Now we just have to put a TV on your head. All right, class. Today, we're going to be doing mathematics. Oh, I love mathematics. And speaker Man, since you love math so much, do you know the answer to this question? The answer to this question, well, one plus one, huh? I think one plus one equals window. Uh, no, that is very incorrect. Oh, you're so dumb. Hey, TV Man, I'm not dumb. You're dumb. You didn't even get the answer correct. The answer is two. What? No, the answer isn't two. Well, actually, the answer is two. What? Are you serious? The answer is two? See, I told you you were incorrect. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, I'm so much better than you at math. Are you serious? What? I'm not even that dumb. Oh, my gosh. Well, hey, teacher, give me another question. All right, what is 9 plus 10? 9 plus 10, uh, let me think. I think the answer to this equation is 21. What? You can't be serious, speaker man. That is the wrong answer. Uh, no, TV man, it is not the wrong answer. Stop making fun of me. You are literally so dumb. The answer is 19, teacher. You are correct once again, TV man. What? Are you kidding me? That is not the correct answer. Well, sadly it is. Don't worry, speaker Speaker man, you'll get the hang of it. Oh my gosh, you're so mean. I'm going to cry. All right, go cry, little baby. <laughs> you're such a meanie. Oh my gosh. I hate him so much. I'm just going to go cry in the bathroom. <laughs> I'm so upset. Oh, hello there, Titan Speaker Man. Uh, who are you? I'm Skibbity Toilet. Oh, yes, yeah, Skibbity Toilet. Well, what are you doing in this toilet? Well, I'm a toilet, so I have to be in the bathroom. What brings you in today? Well, honestly, Skibbity Toilet, I'm just super duper sad because TV Man keeps bullying me. What? Titan TV Man keeps bullying you? Yeah, he's such a big bully, and he keeps calling me dumb. Well, why is he calling you dumb? Well, because I literally got the math equation wrong two times in a row. But don't worry. I have a way that can make you not as dumb. Wait, what, dude? Really? Well, what is it? Well, since Titan TV Man is so smart, 
I can turn you into Titan TV Man. No way. Can you really? Yep, I sure can. All right, well, how? Well, what I need you to do is go ahead and sit on this toilet right here. Oh, uh, okay. I'll sit on the toilet. And when I flush the toilet, you should go down with it, and then you'll come back up as Titan TV Man. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready, Skippy Toilet. All right, here goes nothing. Whoa. Oh, I feel kind of weird, Skippy Toilet. Wait a second. I'm TV Man now. Yep, you sure are. Thanks a lot, Skippy Toilet. Oh, my gosh. Now I can cause so much havoc and get revenge on him. But let's see. Is he still in school? Huh, I'm going to go to the pool and swim all day. Oh, my gosh. He's literally leaving right now. Okay, okay. Well, guys, today I'm literally going to pretend to be and I'm going to ruin his whole entire life. It's going to be so funny. But, uh -huh, what should I do first? Let me think. Huh, maybe I should steal his car first. Oh, my gosh. Look, he has such a tiny car right here. And I can literally stop inside it. I'm going to go drive to his house. And I'm going to prank his whole entire family as him. And, oh, my gosh. This is their house right here. And it's so big. Okay. Well, I'm just going to go up these stairs. And I'm going to sneak inside of the house. And hopefully none of his parents are home. And, oh, man. His dad is right there. Oh, man. I'm so tired. My back hurts so bad. Okay. Well, I'm just going to try to sneak in here. And, oh, my gosh. They somehow don't see me. Oh, hey, Titan TV man. Oh, my gosh. They saw me. Oh, uh, hey, guys. Yeah, I came home early today because uh, the school is out. Oh, school's out? Okay. Well, why does your voice sound way high pitched? Yeah, that's kind of weird. Oh, well, guys, they were having a party at school today, and I, I drank helium. What? How do you drink helium? You're literally a TV. Oh, uh, I mean, I'm sick, Dad. Oh, you're sick? Okay. Well, hopefully you feel better. Well, me and your mom are just going to relax on this couch. Okay, Mom and Dad, have fun. And, oh, my gosh. Okay, where even is my room? Let's see. Where could his room be? No, this is his room right here. Well, maybe they have an upstairs area. Uh, hey, Mom and Dad, I'm just going to head to my room. All right, have a fun time. Yep, I will. And, okay, this is not my room. This is literally the bathroom. Come on, where is this? And what? Are you kidding me? Is this the only room here? Hey, um, guys, where's my room? Where's your room? What do you mean, where's your room? Oh, uh, sorry, Dad. I kind of forgot where it was. Oh, that's really weird. Well, uh, your room's right here. What, my room is right here? Yeah, we're TVs. You literally can sleep anywhere. What, are you serious right now? I don't want to sleep on the ground, Dad. What, what do you mean? You've been sleeping here for three years. Oh, yeah, I guess I have. Silly me. Oh, my gosh, guys. This is so weird. Why does TV man sleep on the ground outside? That's super duper weird. Well, Dad, honestly, uh, I'm kind of bored of being home right now, so I'm just going to drive around the neighborhood. All right, have a fun time driving around. Do not crash. Uh, okay, Dad, I won't trust me. Wait a second. That just gave me a good idea. What if I literally crash TV man's car? I could literally destroy it. That would be hilarious. Okay. Well, I'm just going to drive around for a little bit, and then I'm going to crash it. This is going to be so funny, but honestly, first, I think I'm going to go stop at the grocery store, and maybe I can prank some people here. All right, so I'm just going to go inside of the grocery store now. Hey, guys. Oh, TV man, welcome back. I guess it's your second time you've been here today. Oh, uh, hey, yeah, uh, yeah, this is my second time being here today. Oh, no. This is bad. TV man was a little here today. Uh, why do you sound so weird? Oh, uh, for no reason, Miss Lady. Oh, man. Hey, what's up, TV man? I just saw you at the pool. What the heck? Who even is this guy? Uh, hey there. Are you still coming back to my house letter tonight? Am I coming back to your house? Uh, yeah, 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 I'll be there. Don't worry. All right, see you then. Bye, Miss Grocery Store Worker. Bye there, Jeremiah. And phew, that was a close one, so I guess I have two things to do. I'm gonna crash his car, and then after I'm done crashing his car, I guess I'll just go to that guy's house. Well, here, let me see. Maybe I can steal some stuff. That would be so funny. Okay, well, what is there expensive to steal? Let's see. Wait a second. These water bottles literally cost like $15 a pop. Okay, well, I'm just gonna grab some of this, and uh, I'm just gonna sneak out. Uh, hey, lady. Oh, hey there, TV man. You must be loving that water a lot. Uh, yeah, I love this water. Yeah, it's your second time getting it today. How weird. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of weird. Well, that would be $15. $15? All right. Oh my gosh, guys, I don't even have any money. Uh, well, girl, wait a second. Look behind you. There's a scary monster. Oh my gosh, a scary monster. Where? Oh, okay, okay. I gotta run. See ya. Hey, come back. Here. No, you can't get me. Oh my gosh. I literally just stole from the store and this water bottle was $15. It's so expensive. Well, now I think I'm just gonna go crash this car and after that I can go to that guy's house. I wonder what's happening there. But, uh, -huh, where should I even crash this car? Let me think. Wait a second. What if I crash it in the pool? Okay. Well, wait a second. I think TV Man's actually there and eh, whatever. I'm just gonna run it straight into the pool. Yes, sir. Wait, the pool is so much fun. But wait a second. What is my car doing inside of here? Oh my gosh. Okay, he's 
actually here. I gotta run. Wait, is this even my car? Wait a second. It has the same license plate. It's my car. How did my car fall into the water? Oh my gosh. You just know it has cars in the water. What am I gonna do? Wait a second. Is that my twin brother? What? He's looking at me. Uh, hey there. Brother, no way. Is that actually you? I didn't know I have a twin brother. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're brothers. Wow, this is so amazing. Do you live in this neighborhood? Do I live here? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I live in the neighborhood. Well, we should totally be friends because we are literally like the same exact species. Uh, yeah, sure. I guess we can be friends. All right, yeah, let's be friends. You want to come to my friend Jeremiah's house later today? Jeremiah's house? Uh, yeah, sure. What's happening there? Oh, you know, we're just going to have the best party ever. What? The best party ever? Uh, okay, yeah, sure. I'm down. All right, come with me. Uh, okay, yeah. When is this party? Well, we're celebrating his birthday, of course. What is his birthday today? Uh, okay. So let me ring the doorbell, Jeremiah. Are you home? Oh, hello. You must be Jeremiah's friend. Yeah, uh, hello there, Jeremiah's mom. We're here for his birthday party. Oh, well, you boys come right inside. All right, thank you so much. You can go ahead and go to Jeremiah's room. He will be here soon. All right, thanks a lot, Jeremiah's mom. Okay, well, let's head off to his room. I think his room is upstairs, and this is probably his room right here. Well, Jeremiah's has a cool room. Yeah, he sure does. Well, while we're waiting for Jeremiah's, how about we play a game? A game? Uh, yeah, sure. I guess we can play a game. All right, let's play Truth or Dare. Truth or Dare? Okay, sure. Well, who's going first? You're going first, obviously. Uh, okay, yeah, I guess I can go first. Well, I dare you to take off your helmet. What? Uh, no, no, no. My head doesn't come off. Well, what do you mean your head doesn't come off? I thought it was like a costume or something. What? No, why would this be a costume? Well, because you look exactly like me. Are you sure your TV can't come off your head here? Let me try to pull it off. No, 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 no. Do not try to... Oh, TV man, this is so much fun. I love watching the black screen for 24 hours. Yeah, this is literally my favorite show in the whole entire world. Wow, it's so entertaining. Yeah, dude, it sure is. Well, speaker man, we've been watching this for literally like two hours. So how about we go do something? What do you want to do today? What, you want to go do something, bro? Are you serious? All right. Well, uh, maybe we can go eat some pizza at the pizza shop. Some pizza at the pizza shop? Okay, that sounds like a plan. I love pizza. Yeah, bro, me too. Well, dude, let's hop in your car and let's get going. All right, yeah, dude, let's go. Oh, uh, <laughs> wait a second. What the heck, uh, dude? TV woman literally just sent me a Snapchat. What? She sent you a Snapchat? Snapchat, uh, okay, that's really weird. Yeah, do you think I should open it? Uh, yeah, bro, just open it real quick and let's get this pizza, dude. I'm literally starving. All right, bro, yeah, here, I'll open it and wait a second. Why did she just send me so many pregnant emojis and I think she just said me at the burger place? What the heck? Dude, what? Why does she want to meet you there? I have no idea, dude. I think she has something to tell me, though. Well, I mean, she put pregnant emojis and she said we meet at the burger place. So maybe that means that she's super duper hungry and she has a big stomach and she wants to eat a burger. Bro, honestly, that's not even a bad idea. Yeah, that's that's probably what's happening. Well, dude, let's go to the burger place and let's see what she even wants. Well, dude, we're here, so let's hop out and, uh, dude, I literally see her right inside right there. Wait a second, you see her? Uh, I don't see her. What the heck? Why are you looking at the orange window, dude? She's literally right here in this window. Oh, okay, yeah, I see her right there, okay. Well, uh, hey there, TV woman. We are here to eat some burgers with you. Uh, Speaker Man, I didn't tell TV Man to come. Uh, guys, I'm literally trapped outside. Help me. Oh, my gosh, Speaker Man, what are you doing? Get inside of here. And, oh, oh my gosh. That door was literally was so weird. Uh, well, TV woman, what were you saying? I said I didn't invite TV man. Well, I'm sorry, TV woman. We were literally hanging out watching Black Street for 24 hours. Yeah, and we were about to go get some pizza, but I guess we're gonna get burgers instead because you are so hungry, apparently. I mean, that's why you sent the pregnant emoji, right? Yeah, you just want to eat a lot of food so you get a big tummy, right? Uh, no, that's not what I meant. Wait, uh, what? what do you mean that's not what you meant? Speaker man, I'm pregnant! Wait, what the heck? You're pregnant? What? You're pregnant? Oh my gosh, I thought we were just gonna eat burgers! Well, we can still eat burgers, but I had to tell Speaker Man that I'm carrying his baby. Bro, what? How the heck did that even happen? Hey, yo! Well, I don't know how it happened, but Speaker Man, we gotta prepare. I'm gonna have a baby in a few hours. Wait, what the heck? You're gonna have a baby in a few hours? Yeah, the baby's coming so quick. Okay, now this is super duper weird. I think she's lied to you and trying to take your money again. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, dude, uh, she's pretty weird, uh, TV woman. How can I know that you're not lying to me? Here, I'll send you a photo on your Snapchat. It's literally of the baby. Wait, what? You have a photo of the baby already? What the heck? Yeah, I do. Here, let me send you the photo. Oh my gosh, all right. Okay, I sent it. Look on Snapchat. Oh my gosh. You better not be joking with me right now. Okay, here, I'll be open it. What the heck? You literally sent me a photo of a baby. No way. See, I told you I'm not lying. We need to prepare. Oh my goodness. I can't believe this right now. Well, TV woman, how are we supposed to even prepare? Well, I'm going to prepare by eating, and you and TV man can go and get some baby supplies. Wait, what? We got to get baby supplies? Why don't you get baby supplies? Because I am pregnant and i am super duper hungry oh my goodness i can't believe it well tv woman i guess we'll get baby supplies tonight is there anything specifically that you need yep i'll 
Snapchat you a whole entire list. Wait, what? A whole entire list? Oh my gosh. All right. Well, Speaker Man, we don't have a lot of time, so we got to get going. Let's go. Yeah, bro. We got to get going. All right, perfect. Well, the grocery store is right here, so let's go inside and try to find some. All right, yeah, bro. Let's go to the store real quick, and let's go inside. Hopefully, they have some baby milk. Well, let's go inside and ask this lady for some baby milk. All right, and uh, hey there, Miss Lady. By chance, do you guys have some baby milk? Oh, what? Baby milk? Why do you need that? Oh, well, because I'm literally going to have a baby. But you're a man. You can't have a baby. Bro, what? I mean, I'm not having it. This girl is having it, dude. Uh Sense. Well, come on. We need our milk already. We do not have much time. Okay, hold your horses, dude. I gotta go check and see if we have any baby milk. All right, Miss Lady. Oh, well, dude, hopefully they have some baby milk. Yeah, hopefully they do. And we just so happen to have some baby milk. Wait, what the heck? You actually do? No way. Yeah. All right, thanks a lot, missus. Yeah, no problem. Good luck with your baby. Yeah, thanks a lot. Well, TV man, this is the first out of many items that we got for the baby. I think we only have like one hour and 45 minutes left. Yeah, so we gotta get going. This is not good. Yeah, I know, bro. Well, first, I gotta send TV Woman a Snapchat that I actually got this baby bottle. So here, let me get a Snapchat real quick. It'll let me send it to her. So let me post. I'm gonna put on a filter. And I'm gonna say baby bottle acquired. And I'm gonna send it to her. Let's go. And oh my gosh, she already opened it. Come on. She has to send me the next item fast. And look, she just sent me a Snapchat. Okay. Next, we need baby diapers. Uh, dude. We literally need to get baby diapers for the baby. Oh, okay, Sticker Man. Let's go. Well, dude. I've never had a baby before in my life. So, uh, do you even know where they sell these baby diapers at? Uh, no, I literally have no idea. Bro, are you serious right now? Okay, well, uh, maybe they sell it at, like, a clothing store or something. Yeah, they probably sell them here. But if they don't have baby diapers, then you know what? The baby could just use my diaper instead. Wait, what? You have diapers? Are you serious, bro? Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no. I did not say that out loud. Okay, well, come on. Let's get these clothing. All right, yeah, let's do it. So let's go inside and, uh, hey there, missus. Hi, welcome to Chick Clothing. How may I help you today? Well, I'm gonna have a baby in, like, one hour and 30 minutes, so I kind of need some baby diapers. Oh, baby diapers? Diapers? Okay. And are these for you or your friend? Wait, what? Are these for me or my friend? Are you serious, lady? Dude, it's literally for a baby. So come on, give us the diapers already. Okay, okay, calm down. Well, TV man, by the way, once we get the diapers, I think one of us are literally gonna have to wear so we can see if it's actually worth for a baby. Uh, okay, well, uh, I guess I'll wear them, speaker man. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be so bad. Wait, what the heck? You're gonna wear diapers? No way, bruh. Dude, you literally just told me that I had to wear them, so you know what? I'm gonna wear it. Okay, well, thanks a lot, dude, and, uh, Oh, Mrs., did you just find the diapers already? Yep, the diapers are in this bag. Wait, what? No way. Here you go. All right, uh, thanks a lot. And TV man, look, bro. I literally got the baby diapers. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I can't believe I have to try this on. Give me the bag, and I'll just change in the changing room. Uh, okay, bro. Here you go. This is literally so crazy. I can't believe I'm doing this right now. Hey, guys. I bet you TV man's gonna look hilarious when he comes out of here. Okay, let me just put it on real quick. And perfect. Wait a second. What the heck is that, bro? bro I'm the dinosaur diaper. Bro, what? Hold on, lady. Did you give us a dinosaur diaper? Yeah, what other diaper did you want? Bro, we need a white baby diaper. Like one that's poop resistant. Well, that dinosaur is poop resistant. Uh, we are not a baby store, so we did not sell baby diapers. Oh my gosh. Come on, lady. Give us a white baby diaper. Don't worry, speaker man. Don't worry. There's actually one more diaper in the back. Here, let me put it on real quick. All right, pro. This lady, that better be a white baby diaper they're speaking about. And it's a teddy bear diaper. Oh my gosh. I forgot I put that in there. Bro, what a teddy Teddy bear diaper, bruh. Are you serious right now? Your baby's gonna be looking so stylish, speaker man. We'll buy them, lady. Okay, perf. That will be $500. Bro, what the heck? That is way too expensive. Well, if you don't want our exclusive baby diapers, I guess you could get a white shirt and have your baby wear it. A white shirt? No, no, no. Okay, you know what? I will buy your exclusive baby diapers, okay? All right, perf. Thank you so much. Yep, no problem. There you go, lady. And you know what? I'm gonna wear this green dinosaur diaper because this thing is literally so cool. Bro, are you serious? Oh my gosh. All right. Well, TV man, we gotta send TV woman to Snapchat that we have the diapers now. So here, bro. Stand right here and I'll send you a Snapchat. All right, but first, let me strike a pose. Oh, yeah. Bro, what are you serious? Okay, here. Let me put on a filter and look, bro. We're literally doggies. Oh my gosh, we look so funny, brother. Yeah, I know. Wait a second. I can turn around the camera. Okay, hold on, bro. Hold on. Hold on. And perfect. Let me take a photo of you and oh my gosh, okay. I'm to capture this diapers acquired. And now what else do we need? Huh, I don't know, bro. I just sent her that Snapchat. But hopefully she sends me something soon. Well, here. In the meantime, let's go back in the car. All right, yeah, let's go inside over the car. And dude, look, she sent me another Snapchat. Great, now get a stroller. Bro, are you serious? Does my baby literally need a stroller? Yeah, dude, all babies need a stroller. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Well, TV man, where would we even buy a stroller at? Uh, I'm not really sure. Maybe they would have a stroller somewhere laying around outside or something. Bro, no. I don't think people would do that. 
Well, maybe they have it at like a car dealership or something. Or maybe they have it at this daycare right here. Hey, yeah. speaker man, cut back your dude. Bro, what? You just hopped in my car. Oh my gosh. All right, yeah. Maybe they'll have it at the daycare. Huh? Let's go see. But wait a second. Uh, there's literally no one here, speaker man. Yeah, so I guess we're just gonna have to wait for people. Wait a second. What? Bro, where are you going? Oh my gosh, I see a stroller. Wait, dude, are you serious? We're literally breaking inside of this daycare right now. No, we're not, speaker man. The doors were already open. Look at this. Bro, are you serious? Are you just gonna steal that stroller? Yeah, I mean, it's sitting here. We just got a free stroller now. Come on. Bro, hey, put me down. We just got a free stroller, Speaker Man. Come on. Oh, my goodness, dude. Stealing is so bad. I think you should put that back. Hey, stop it, bro. No, come on. Drive fast, fast, fast. Bro, what are you serious? Oh, my gosh. All right. Oh, man, we just got a free stroller. Oh, yeah, I guess we did, bro. Well, we still got to send a photo to TV woman. So here, let me get in the stroller and I'll send her a photo of us. Oh, my gosh. You look so hilarious, Speaker Man. But I'm surprised they just had a stroller laying inside of there. Uh, that was super, duper random. Yeah, sure it was. Here, let me put on another filter on us. Now I'm going to send her a photo of me in the stroller. And I'm going to say I got the stroller. And perfect, I sent it to her, bro. All right, perfect, bro. And I think the baby is going to be bored any minute now. Wait a second. Any minute now? Oh, my gosh. I'm flying by so much. Yeah, I know. This is not good. Well, hop out of the stroller and we got to get going. Come on. Yeah, bro. We sure do, but wait a second. She just opened my snap. Okay, here. Let's wait and see what she's going to say. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. She sent me a snap at the hospital. Come quick. Wait a second, dude. I think she's giving birth to the baby, like, right now. All right, go, 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 speaker man. Ah! This is literally so crazy. There's a baby coming out. Oh, my goodness, dude. This is an emergency. Let's go fast. Oh, my gosh. Come on, come on. We have to figure out what floor she's on. All right, bro. Wait a second. Hey, get me out of the stroller. Oh, uh, okay, okay. No, speaker man. There's no time for you to get out of the stroller. Do the elevators work? No, the elevators are broken. Bro, are you serious? Oh, my gosh. We gotta find stairs or something. Yeah, I know, but how are we supposed to walk up the stairs? Oh, no. You're literally inside of a stroller. Okay. Well, let's look around. Maybe they're inside of there. No, they're not. Oh, where is TV woman? I don't know, bro. Here. Let me send her a Snapchat real quick. And let me ask, where are you? And she just sent me something back second floor. Oh my gosh, dude. How are we supposed to get up? Come on, come on. These elevators gotta work, bro. Wait a second. Oh my gosh. They're opening now. Quick, get inside. Bro, what? Hey. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Well, at least we're able to go to the second floor now, bro. Yeah, we'll hop in the stroller. Come on, we have to find her. All right, bro. Well, here, check the surgery room. Maybe she's in there. All right, well, let's see if she's inside if you're in. Oh no, where is she? I don't know. Wait a second. TV woman, oh my gosh. Here's our new baby. Oh my gosh, that baby is so cute. Don't worry, speaker man. I will take off this diaper soon and give it to your baby. Uh, thanks a lot. And TV woman, what are we going to name our baby? I was thinking TV man Jr. Wait a second. What the heck? TV man Jr.? TV man, this is actually your baby. What? Uh, TV man, that breakfast was so amazing, bro. Yeah, it was really delicious. Well, speaker man, what do you want to do now? Do you want to go back to your house and play some video games? Wait, what? You want to play video games at my house? Honestly, that's not even a bad idea, bro. All right, well, uh, let's go to your house and let's play some video games then. All right, yeah, let's do it. This is gonna be super duper fun. Yeah, I cannot wait. Well, dude, let's hop my car and let's head over to my house. Wait a second, bro. Uh, I think I just got a Snapchat on my phone. Wait, really? You did? Who's it from? Uh, dude, it says it's from TV Woman here. Wait, let me click this real quick and uh, wait a second. Dude, guess what she just sent me? Uh, what did she send you? It better not have been anything weird. Uh, well, dude, it is kind of weird. She sent me a photo of herself half of the wall and she said, hey, Speaker Man. With a smiley face. Oh, Speaker Man, that's not even anything weird. She's literally just saying hi to you. Bro, really? I mean, that was kind of suspicious and out of the blue. Like, she literally never even Snapchats me. Uh, I wouldn't think much about it. Let's just go to your house and play video games. Just ignore her. Uh, all right, dude, whatever. Well, TV Man, let's get going. And we made it to your house. I'm so excited to play video games, Speaker Man. What games do you even have? Bro, I literally got all of the games, dude. Well, here, let's go inside real quick. And let's see, um, what games do I even have? Well, I have all these games over here. And oh my gosh, dude, I just found the perfect one here. Let me turn on the TV and put this in. All right, dude, this is gonna be so lit. Yeah, it sure is. Well, here, let's see. Wait a second. What the heck? Uh, dude, this is kind of weird. Uh, what happened now, Speaker Man? Bro, TV Woman literally sent me another Snapchat. Bro, really? What did it say? I'm not sure, dude. Well, here, let me open it real quick and, uh, wait a second. She just asked if I wanted to hang out? Wait, what? She asked if you wanted to hang out? Yeah, dude, what the heck? That is super duper weird. Yeah, that is super duper weird. Why is she texting you so much? Dude, honestly, I got no idea. I didn't even respond to her yet. This is really suspicious, Speaker Man. I think she might have a crush on you. Wait, what, dude? You think she may have a crush on me? Yeah, I mean, maybe. She's literally stopping you out of the blue. Like, she never messages you, right? Yeah, she sure doesn't. That's weird, bro. Oh, dude, do you think 
think I should send her a Snapchat back? Yeah, I think you should. You should say something like, do you have a crush on me? And if she says yes, then that is going to be very suspicious. Oh, uh, yeah, that's true, dude. Well, here. Let me pull out my cell phone real quick and let's go to Snapchat. And dude, I'm going to send her a Snapchat right now. Well, here, let me click my camera. I'm going to put on a doggy filter just like that. And let me send her a Snapchat real quick. And okay. Here, I got to add some text. So let's see. What should I say? Dude, just put, do you have a crush on me? Uh, all right, bro. Well, here. Let me type that real quick. And dude, I'm literally going to send it to her right now. Oh, my gosh. I really wonder what she's going to say. Yeah, me too, speaker, man. But at least we'll get a clear answer now. Well, don't worry about TV woman. Let's just uh, put in this game and play this game. Come on, speaker, man. Yeah, you know what, bro? That's a good idea. Here, grab a controller. And I'll set up the game real quick. All right. Wait a second. You have the new Rode PS5? Yeah, bro. I literally do. Dude, this thing's literally like $500. Oh, my gosh. That's literally so crazy. Yeah, I know. Well, dude, we're going to be playing this cooking game right here. Oh, boy. This is going to be so much fun. I love Boxy Ramsey. Yeah, me too, dude. But wait a second. What the heck? Oh, uh, bro. I'm pretty sure she just Snapchatted me again. Oh, no. What did she say this time? I'm not sure. Let's see. And wait a second. Maybe he, he? Wait a second. So she has a crush on you? Oh, my goodness, dude. That is super duper suspicious. Why does she have a crush on me? Yeah, you guys literally haven't talked in forever. Okay, that's really weird. Something is definitely up with her. There's no way that she has a crush on you out in the blue. Yeah, dude. That is super duper weird. And wait a second, bro. No way. She just sent me another Snapchat in like one second. Oh, no. What did she say now? Dude, let's see. Wait a second. Can we go on a date? What? She wants to go on a date with you? Okay. Now, this is very suspicious. Dude, this is super duper creepy. Well, what do I even respond with? Uh, I don't know. I guess you should probably go on the date. But we're literally supposed to be playing video games. Yeah, I know. But if you go on this date with her, she'll probably stop Snapchatting you. So you should probably go on that date and figure out why she has a crush on you. Oh, my goodness, dude. So you're saying I should Snapchat her back and tell her that I'll go on a date with her? Yeah, dude, that's what I'm saying. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe it, dude. This is going to be so crazy. Well, here. Let me open up Snapchat, and I'm going to send her another photo. Uh, what filter should I put on this time, dude? Put on the rainbow bar filter this time. I think girls love that. Okay, dude. Yeah, hopefully she does. Well, the filter is on now, and I'm going to post cheese. What should the caption of the post say? Dude, literally just tell her that you want to go on a date. Come on. It's not that hard. Okay, okay, bro. This is literally going to be my first time going on a date ever. Well, here, let me type. Yes. <laughs> dude, I just sent it to her. Oh, my gosh, speaker man. Okay. I wonder what she's going to say to you. This is going to be really sus. Yeah, dude. And hopefully on the date, she's not super duper crazy because that would be super duper weird. Yeah, but you need to go there and figure out why she has a crush on you because uh, this is really weird. Yeah, dude, it sure is. Well, wait a second. What the heck? Dude, she literally just responded in milliseconds. I'm not sure. Yet. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll be there. Student XOXO. What the heck? Ew, XOXO. What the heck? Okay, well, it seems like she's gonna be here soon, so you should probably wait outside. Hold on, dude. She just sent me a message and, uh, wait a second here. Uh, dude, she's literally in my house this door right uh give me a woman how in the heck did he just get here uh speaker man you just left the door open are you sure you just didn't break down the door uh yeah i totally cannot break down the store all right well now that you're here tv woman you guys can go on a date yeah, yeah i'm so excited for our date oh uh, dude tv man please don't leave me bro i'm pretty sure she literally just broke down my door yeah uh that is really creepy don't worry speaker man i won't leave you i'll be around just snapchat me if you need me and try to figure out why she has a crush on you okay bro you know what i'll do that well tv man see you bro and uh tv woman hi yeah uh, it's nice to meet you. Yes, it's so nice to meet you, too. Yeah, same. Well, uh, what do you want to do? I've kind of never been on a date before. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that's so sweet. I can't believe I'm your first ever date. Yeah, I can't believe it either. Well, Speaker Man, you're the man, so you gotta choose where our date is. Choose? Are you serious? I've literally never been on a date, though. Yep, that's the gentleman thing to do. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe it. Well, TB Woman, how about we go to Ferris Wheel? What? A Ferris Wheel? Oh, my gosh. How romantic. All right, yeah, sure. That's romantic. Well, let's go outside and hop my car and we can go to the ferris wheel all the way over there it is so massive all right speaker man and maybe while we're on there we can kiss wait what the heck you want to kiss me yes i would love to kiss you uh bro what the heck okay you're crazy uh no i'm not crazy i just want to kiss you that's what you do on dates really uh okay well i don't really know about that well here we're literally at the ferris wheel right now so let's hop out of the car and let's go on it hopefully we can get to the tippity top wow the ferris wheel is so big well let's go up and uh wait a second i gotta do something on my phone real quick. Oh, okay. Take your time, speaker man. All right, TV woman. Guys, this is so crazy. TV woman literally said she wants to kiss me. I really have to tell speaker man about this while here. Let me go on Snapchat and let me send him a Snapchat. And oh my gosh, guys. This is crazy. Let me add a caption that says, dude, she wanted to kiss me. And I'm going to send it to him. Oh my goodness. Guys, this is so insane right now. Speaker man, come on. Get off your phone. 
Man, we're supposed to be on a date. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, TV woman. Gosh, hopefully TV man responds to me. Well, uh, TV woman, let's go on the Ferris wheel. Yay, I'm so excited. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. And whoa, look at this. This is massive. So what we got to do is go over here and then jump on it. Uh, wait a second. TV woman, I got to check my phone again. Oh, my gosh, guys. TV man, just Snapchat me and let's see. That is so weird. Don't worry. I'm hiding at the Ferris wheel. Wait, what the heck? He's hiding at the Ferris wheel? Oh, come on, speaker man. This is supposed to be a date. Get off of your cell phone. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot. Don't worry. It's okay. I know this is your first date, but you're not supposed to be on your phone the whole time. Yeah, I'm sorry. Well, here. Let's go on the Ferris wheel and, uh, whoa. We're literally going so high up. Wow, the water is so pretty from up here. Yeah, it sure is. Well, speaker man, do you want to kiss? Bro, what? Uh, honestly, TV woman, I do not want to kiss right now. What? Come on. We're literally at the tippy top of the Ferris wheel. Yeah, I know, but I really do not want to kiss you. I'm sorry. Okay. Tippy top of the Ferris wheel. Good job, speaker man. Yep, I'm sorry about that. Well, TV woman, honestly, I have a question for you. Uh, okay, what's your question? I was kind of wondering why do you have a crush on me? Well, honestly, I've been stalking your Snapchat for a while, and I think you are so awesome. Wait, what? You've been stalking my Snapchat? Uh, yeah, surprise. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it right now. Well, speaking of Snapchat, let's take a photo. Wait, what? You want to take a photo with me? Yeah, and now that we're at the tippity top, let's kiss. Wait, what? You want to kiss and take a photo with me? What the heck? Yeah. Three, two, one, go! Oh my gosh! Oh, this is so romantic! Blah, blah. Oh my gosh, okay. I'm gonna post this on my story for the whole entire world to see. Wait, what? You're gonna post it on your story? Oh my gosh, no way. Are you kidding me? Why would he post that? Because now we are dating, speaker man! Bro, what? I've only known you for like one hour. Oh, come on. I'm a great gal. Bro, no, honestly, I think you're crazy and you have a humongous crush on me. So, you know what? I'm hopping off of here. I'm getting away from you. Wait, what? No, speaker man. Come back here. No, I'm gonna hop on this ride and I'm gonna ride away from you. Oh, well, I'm gonna get on the ride then, too. Wait, what the heck? You're gonna get on this ride with me? Yes, it's gonna be so much fun. Oh, my gosh. No, no, no. Please don't. And then we can try kissing again. Bro, what? I do not want to kiss you. No, wait a second. What the heck? Yay, we're on the ride together, speaker man. Let's take another selfie. No, I don't want to take a selfie with you. And, uh, wait a second. I have to check my phone real quick. Oh, my gosh. No, speaker man. Ah! Oh, my gosh. She's literally on the ride by herself. Okay, I gotta run. Hey, let me off of here. And, guys, oh, my gosh. TV man literally sent me a Snapchat. Let me see this. Bro, TV woman posts you guys for the whole world to see, bro. I cannot believe this right now. Wait a second. How many Snapchat friends does she even have? Oh, my gosh. I gotta ask TV man ASAP. Dude, how many friends does she even have? Dude, she has one million? What the heck? She literally has one million friends on snapchat oh my gosh i cannot believe this right now you know what i'm gonna barf everywhere Blech. and wait a second she sent me a snapchat as well ride with my babe bro i can't believe it oh my gosh we're finally off that ride here speaker man come here and kiss me bro what no 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 you literally have one million snapchat friends and you posted that stuff of us kissing yeah why we and i we're dating bro what no we're dating you're just crazy and you have a crush on me and thank you for buying this hot dog for me wait what i did not buy you that hot dog well i took your wallet while you were on the ride bro Bro, what? Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Say hot dog. Wait a second. What? I'm going to post this so my one million friends can see. Bro, what? Are you serious? No, no, no. Do not post that. Bro, are you serious? That is so embarrassing. Oh, speaker man, I just got a notification that my nail appointment is ready, so I got to go and take your car. Thank you. Wait, what the heck? You're going to take my car? Hey, no, no, no. Oh, my gosh. This is so bad. I got to snap TV man right now. I got to ask him for help. Bro, legit help me, dude. Oh, my gosh. They believe just snapped me back, bro. What happened? Do you need help? Yeah, bro. I literally need help. And he just snapped me back. Okay, I'm on my way. Okay, thanks a lot, bro. Hey, speaker man, get off your phone. Bro, you're literally driving my car right now. Yeah, because I need to go to my nail appointment. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe it. Wait a second. TV man, help me, bro. And here we are. Thank you a lot, speaker man. Oh, my gosh. You just crashed my car. Speaker man, are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay, bro. But look, she literally just crashed my car. Oh, my gosh. TV woman is so crazy. Dude, you should have seen what she was doing on Snapchat. She was literally sending me photos of you guys kissing. Bro, yeah. Apparently, she posted that for one million friends to see. Yeah, she did. She is literally so crazy. I think she just wanted to go on a date with you so she could steal your money. Oh, well, wait a second. Where is your credit card? Bruh, she literally stole it from me. She bought a hot dog with it. Wait a second. Dude, she's probably using it to pay for her nails. Oh my gosh, this lady is literally so crazy. She's a gold digger. TV woman, you're literally a gold digger. And you just sent me a Snapchat that says free nails for my pay XOXO? Yeah, I'm using your credit card so I can pay for my nails. Thanks a lot, babe. What? Are you serious? Huh? Give that back to me. Hey, give that back. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna Snapchat everyone and tell them that we broke up. Yeah, you better do that. You're so crazy. Okay, speaker man, get in my photo. I'm not gonna get in your photo. I'm perfect. Okay, you guys, go like my new Snapchat story. I'm out of here.
here. Bro, what are you serious? Oh my gosh, dude. Honestly. Thankfully, she's gone now. Yeah, thankfully she is. But dude, she literally had a crush on you just because she wanted your money. Yeah, dude. I can't believe it. She just sent me a photo that says we broke up. Oh my gosh. She is literally so evil. I can't believe that you just got tricked by her. But wait a second. What the heck? She's in your car. Hey, get back here. What the heck are you doing? Haha, <laughs> check your stuff. Bro, what? How she drive my broken car? Oh my gosh, wait a second. What did she just send me on Snapchat? New whip? Are you kidding me? Wow, she really just wanted you just because you're money, speaker man. Dude, I cannot believe it. Uh, you know what? I think we should expose her for being a gold digger. Yeah, let's do it, dude. We do not want anyone else to date her. Uh, TV man, this is the best show in the whole entire world. Black Street for 24 hours is my favorite. Yeah, we literally watch this show all the time. It is literally the best show in the world. Yeah, it sure is, bro. Well, Speaker Man, after we're done watching this, what do you want to do? Huh, honestly, TV man, I think that we should go downtown and shop at every single store. Shop at every single store? Uh, all right. Oh, wait a second, bro. Uh, what the heck? TV woman literally sent me a Snapchat here. Let me see what she just said. And, uh, wait, what the heck, uh, dude? Look at this. Bro, what the heck? Is that us in the back? right there yeah bro what the heck even is that wait what? how did she get that photo of us here let me go back here and uh wait what that is super duper weird maybe she just photoshopped her face over a photo yeah maybe she did because she is not in our backyard okay that is very suspicious but you know what she's probably just pulling a prank on us or something oh uh, yeah that's actually super duper weird well here i'm gonna reply back and i'm gonna say funny prank and i just sent it to her oh my gosh she is so funny well tv man i think we're done watching the live stream for 24 hours yeah i think we're done let's go to the shopping mall now yeah bro Oh, let's go. It's going to be so much fun. And let's go outside and let's hop in my brand new cyber truck. Wait a second. You got a new car? I remember your Lamborghini, but now you have a cyber truck. Whoa. Yes, sir. I sure do. This is lit. Hold up, bro. She just sent me another snap. Wait, what the heck? Dude, what does it say this time? Huh, let me see real quick, dude. She's being so suspicious. Oh, uh, wait, what the heck? Dude, she literally sent me a photo of us in my cyber truck. Hey, wait a second. Where is she? Dude, this is freaking me out. Why is she literally stalking us? Yeah. Uh, look at this. There's literally nowhere that she could be hiding. Everything is open land out here. Yeah, but wait a second, dude. She sent me a photo from all the way back here, so maybe she's back here. And wait a second, bro. Why are you serious? She's not even back here. Okay, this is very, very weird. But you know what? We just have to ignore it until something else happens. Let's just go shopping. Come on. All right, bro. Yeah. If she snaps me back again with a photo of us, dude, I'm going to get super duper suspicious because that is where she's literally going to be a stalker. Yeah, well, we are at the shopping area. So now it's time to buy some stuff. Yeah, bro. Let's buy some stuff well, first, dude. Honestly, I think that we should go to the salon and get our hair done. What? Get our hair done? No, that's for girls. Bro, but come on. My hair is literally like super duper bad right now. I need a haircut. Speaker man, you don't even have hair, dude. Bro, I know. Well, just trust me. Come on. Let's go get our hair done, dude. <sighs> okay, whatever you say. Well, I'm just going to sit down in this chair right here. And uh, wait a second. It's not letting me sit down. Oh, my gosh. See, Speaker man, I told you. It's girls only. Bro, I can't believe it. There's not even a worker here. Yeah, I know. I think we actually just broke inside of here. Uh-oh, that's bad. Bro, wait a second. Bro, what? <laughs> Sent me another Snapchat and it says, Boys at a girl's hair salon, lol. See, I told you, Speaker Man, but wait a second, where is she? Hey, TV woman, where are you? What? Uh, TV woman, get over here. Stop taking photos of us. Wait, what the heck? Bro, where did she even go? Oh my gosh, Speaker Man, this is really weird. She has to be pulling some sort of prank on us. No, dude, I don't think she's pranking us. She's literally stalking us. Wait a second. Yeah, she is. She literally done this like four times already. Well, you know what, Speaker Man, come on. Let's just get some coffee and relax. Bro, what? You want to relax after that? Are you serious? Yes, bro. We need to just not worry about oh it. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it, bro. But if she says it one more time, I'm literally gonna hop in my Tesla cyber truck and I'm gonna drive around the whole entire town until I find her. Yeah, that's a good idea. Well, uh, it seems like they have the AI robots working today. Oh, man. Well, I guess I'll just take one coffee AI robot. Wait a second, bro. What in the heck? She just sent me another Snapchat. No way, no way. I can't believe this is happening right now. Yeah, you have to be joking me, speaker man. Let me see this also. Bro, it says hi, boys, and wait, what? She's on a roof? Quick, now's our time. Let's go find her. Uh, get back here, TV woman. Oh, Oh my goodness, dude, I'm my cyber truck right now. We gotta figure out where TV Woman is. And wait a second. Hey, TV Woman. Uh-oh, I gotta run. Oh, uh, get back here, TV Woman. Hey, hey, how do we even get up there? Oh my gosh, she's literally so good. How did she get up there? Catch me if you can. Wait, what? Catch her if I can't? Oh my gosh. You know what? I'll hop in my cyber truck right now. Hop it, bro. And we're gonna catch her. Dude, I literally just want to get my coffee, but this lady's stalking us. Uh, oh my gosh. Are you serious? I just flipped my car. And just like that, I think we lost TV Woman. Oh my gosh. Where did she go? She is literally stalking us. This is literally so weird. Yeah, dude. It really is. You know what? I think we're gonna have to do something about this now. Yeah, but what do we do? We just have to find her, right? Yeah, dude. But once we find her, we gotta interrogate her and ask her why she's stalking us. Yeah, that's a good idea. 
idea. Well, dude, I just came up with a plan. How about we go to some places and we wait inside? And when she sends a photo of us, we get out my cyber truck and run her over and catch her. You know what, Speaker Man? That sounds like a great plan. Because if we stop at different places, she is going to stalk us. And then all we have to do is just run out and get her. Okay, yeah. We'll stop at this pizza place and uh, hopefully she takes a photo of us. But it's going to be pretty hard for her this time. Yeah, dude, because look, there's literally blinds all over the windows. Yeah, I don't think she's going to be able to find us inside of here. Yeah, dude, well, while we're here, can we get some pizza? Yeah, I'm pretty hungry, but I think we just have to wait for someone to come out and serve us. Yeah, dude. Well, hopefully we don't have to wait for long because I'm super duper starving. Hold up, wait a minute. She just sent me another snap in a way. What? Two guys had six guys? Hold on. That's a photo of us, dude. Wait a second. She took a photo from right here. Oh, I'm going to jump out of this window. Oh my gosh, it's way too small, dude. We got to catch her fast. Yeah, Speaker Man, what are you doing? Quick. Where is she? I don't see her out here. Oh, no. She already escaped. Uh, wait, what? She escaped? Wait, hold on, bro. She's literally right here. And wait a second. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that really hurt my... Oh, uh, TV, what? I'm going to get you. Oh. Wait a second. What the heck, TV man? Oh, that hurts so bad. Why do you run into me, dude? I was literally out here looking for her. Bro, I thought you were a TV woman. You guys look the exact same. Bro, no, we don't. She's not as fat as me. Oh, oh no, it really, really hurts. Bro, okay, okay. I'm sorry about that, dude. I accidentally mistaken you for her. Well, come on, bro. You have to take me to the hospital or something. You just ran over me. Bro, the hospital? We literally gotta catch our stalker. Oh, my gosh, dude. Okay. I guess since you're hurt, I will go bring you to the hospital. Yeah, maybe next time, don't run me over with a car. Oh, that is the worst pain that I've ever felt in my life. Okay, okay, dude. Well, hop out of the car. Let's go in. All right, yeah, bro. Well, dude, I think it's self-checking. So we can just go upstairs now. Yeah, literally everything is controlled by robots these days. So I guess we'll just go to floor two. And now you can go into your own room, so let's see, huh? Do you need surgery, do you think? No, I think I just need a bed, so I'm just gonna go inside of here. Alright, bro, yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, bro, I'm just gonna go to bed. And hopefully some robot comes in here and helps me or something. Yeah, bro, hopefully a robot does. Okay, dude, I'm super duper sorry for running you over. It's okay, speaker man, just be more aware next time. Okay, dude, yeah, I'll be more aware. Wait, dude, look behind you! Wait, what? What do you mean, bro? Dude, look at your steps, she was literally right behind you! No, dude, you have to be choking. How would she get here? I don't know, but quick, you have to find her. What are you doing? Hold on, bro. I'm gonna check Snap real quick and bruh. Are you serious? Yeah. She literally took a photo of us, dude. Uh. I'm gonna text her and ask her where she is. So let me write, where are you at? Yeah, I'm gonna send it to her. Because I'm so fed up of TV woman stalking us. And wait a second, she sent me a Snapchat. Okay, here, let me see. Yeah, it is literally a photo of her dressed in a uniform, huh? Where could that... Wait a second. TV man, look! She's getting away! Wait a second, oh! I'm gonna try to get over there, but my legs really hurt. Oh. Bro, TV man, come on, she's literally running out of the door right now. Hey, TV won't get back here. Oh my gosh, catch me if you can. I'm stalking you guys. Oh my gosh, and hey, TV man, you just shut the door in my face, bro. Quick, I have to get her away in a second. She's taking the car. Wait, what? She's taking my car. Haha, <laughs> boys, catch me if you can. Oh my gosh, I have no time to wait for the elevator. I'm jumping over. And all oh, my legs look okay. Well, she left some wheelchairs here, so let's get her. Yeah, let's get her, but uh, where did she go? Hold on, she sent me a snap. <laughs> and she said, new whip, bro. She took a photo of herself in my cyber truck. Huh, okay. Well, is there anything that you could see in the image that, like, shows where she is? Oh, uh, well, there's a building back here, and it's, like, red and white. Wait a second. Bro, there's a red and white building right over here. Maybe that's where she is. All right, hurry, hurry, hurry. I think we might catch her lacking. Yeah, bro, let's go fast. Uh, I'm so upset right now, bro. I can't believe that she's talking to us, and she stole my beautiful cyber truck. I literally just bought that thing. Yeah, I know, right? But wait a second. Look. Oh, my gosh. There is my cyber truck in. Wait a second. Hey, TV woman, stop. Ha ha, boys, bye. Uh, get over here. Wait a second. She just hopped out. Chase her. Come on, bro. We have to confront the stalker. Uh, wait a second. What the heck? She's going on a Ferris wheel. How are we supposed to get her up there? Oh, no. This is not good, speaker man. Bro, we literally have to hop on the Ferris wheel to get her. And, uh, TV woman, stop stalking us. No, I will not stop until you catch me. Wait, what? Okay, well, we're going to have to catch you. And TV woman, can you tell me why you're stalking us? Because I am your stalker. And I will never stop. Wait, what the heck? You'll never stop it. Hey, TV man, she's jump chaser. Hey, where's she going? Hey, get back here. Oh, we're going to catch you and bring you to the police station. You're going to get arrested. No, I am not. You got to catch me first. Oh, get over here. Oh, my gosh. The car isn't starting. Yeah, get over here. Citizens arrest. Hey, get me out of these cuffs. Uh... <laughs> this is why you get first talking to us. You know what? We're going to bring you to the police station now. You're going to be in jail for the rest of your life. Is there anything you want to say? I will continue stalking you even after I get out of jail. Wait, what the heck?
Oh my gosh, Beaker Woman, that food was so delicious. And now I'm super duper full. Yeah, me too. That sandwich was so yummy. Yeah, I know, right? Oh my gosh. I'm such a good chef. Well, Beaker Woman, what do you want to do now? Well, I guess we could just watch on black screen for 24 hours. You know what? Honestly, that's not even a bad idea. Yeah. Let's watch the black screen for 24 hours. This is my favorite show ever. Yeah, it's mine too. Well, somebody just sent me a Snapchat, so I gotta go look at my phone real quick. Oh, all right, Beaker Woman. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's so funny. Wait, what? Uh, what do you mean he? Oh, uh, I meant she. You meant she? Uh, okay, yeah, hopefully you did, because I do not want you talking to any boys. Oh, don't worry, honey, I'm only talking to you. Phew, all right, good. And by the way, Speaker Woman, can you please put your phone down, because I really want us to both watch this TV show. Oh, yeah, sure I can. Oh, wait a second, I just got another Snapchat. Bro, what the heck? You just got another Snapchat? Oh my gosh, who's texting you? It better not be TV Woman again. Oh, uh, yeah, it is. And she needs me right away, so I gotta go. Wait, what? You gotta go? Are you serious, bro? Where are you guys even going? Yeah, I'm so sorry. It's just girls only. Bro, what? No, no, no. You're being super duper suspicious. Oh my gosh. All right, whatever. Bye, Speaker Woman. Bye, Speaker Man. Guys, honestly, Speaker Woman is so suspicious. Like, I honestly don't think someone would be Snapchatting to her that much. Like, that is crazy. She put down her phone for one second, then she got another Snapchat, and now she just left my house. Oh, wait a second. Oh my gosh. I just got a good idea. I gotta follow her. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Where did she go? Oh my goodness. I literally just lost her. Are you kidding me? Huh? Well, you know what? I just thought of this. She said that she's gonna hang out with TV Woman. So I'm gonna Snapchat TV Woman to see if she's actually hanging out with her. Okay, here. Let me open up Snapchat real quick. And let me put on an awesome filter. I'm gonna send this to her. And I'm gonna say in here, is Speaker Woman hanging out with you? And now let me send that to TV Woman real quick. I sent her the Snapchat, so now I just need to wait for a response. And wait a second. She already opened it. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. I wonder what she's gonna say. She better be hanging out with her. And oh my goodness, wait a second. She sent me a Snapchat. Okay, okay. And she said, uh, no, she's not here. Wait a second. What the heck? Guys, this is super duper suspicious. Hold on. Let me reply to her and be like, where is she then? This is not good at all. Honestly, I'm getting super duper suspicious of Speaker Woman. And I think she's cheating on me. And wait a second. She just sent me a snap. Uh, I don't know. Bruh. This is bad, guys. You know what? Here, let me Snapchat Speaker Woman real quick. And I'm gonna ask where she is. And there, I sent it. Oh my gosh, guys. She better not be with someone else. And she just Snapchat me and said, I had TV Woman's house. Wait a second. Guys, she is legit lying to me. That is not TV Woman's house right there. That is someone else's house. Uh, bro. Whose house even is that? Oh my gosh, I forgot. I know that she's lying to me now. So I'm gonna hop in my car. I'm gonna figure out where she is. And I'm gonna expose her. And honestly, guys, I think she may be cheating on me. Well, here, let me hop in my car real quick. I'm gonna drive around town and hopefully I can figure out where she is. Well, here, let me check this house over here first. And let's see, is she here? Oh, uh, no, it doesn't seem like she is. So now I'm just gonna go down here. I think there are some other houses down here. And uh, I don't even see her at all. Oh my goodness. Well, hold on. Let me check my neighbor's house real quick and wait a second. My neighbor's house is literally TV Man. Hold on. This is suspicious. No way she's at TV Man's house. Wait, what? Are you serious right now? Why is her pink car at TV Man's house? No, no, no. She cannot be cheating on me with TV Man. Uh, hello? Knock, knock, knock. Ring, ring, ring. Is anyone home? Uh, TV Man, I think someone's at the door. Go answer it. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. Let me go get the door. Wait a second. Did you guys just hear that too? Pretty positive eyes heard Speaker Woman's voice. Oh, uh, wait a second. Hey there, TV Man. Uh, hey there, Speaker Man. What's up? Hey, bro. Uh, I was just wondering if I can come in real quick because uh, I have high suspicions that my girlfriend is cheating on me with you. Oh, are you talking about Speaker Woman? Uh, she's not even here right now. I'm about to go to bed. You're about to go to bed when I just came to the door. Yeah, right, bro. I mean, look at the sky, Speaker Man. It's literally dark outside, dude. And I've been awake since 3 a.m. in the morning, dude. I am literally so tired. Bro, what? Nah, you're lying to me. You know what? I'm coming in. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. You don't have to come in, bro. Oh, my gosh. Okay, you know what? I guess I'll just show you my bedroom since you want to come into my house so much. All right, dude. Yeah, show me your bedroom. So follow me upstairs, Speaker Man, and you can see my bed since you want to see my bed so badly. All right, bro. Yeah, here. Let me see your bedroom. And okay, yeah. Literally, no one's even in this bedroom. But wait a second. You have closets right here, bro. Bro, you don't have to go through all my closets. I'm literally telling you that your girlfriend is not in my house, okay? I'm literally just trying to go to bed, dude. Yeah, right. Well, here. Let me look inside and okay. She's yeah. not in that closet right there. Well, hold on. Is this your bathroom right here, bro? Oh, uh, no, no, no. Do not go in there. Dude, why should I not go in there? That is super duper suspicious. Oh, uh, just don't go in there, Speaker Man, okay? No, dude. I'm going to go inside and wait a second. Oh my god. Oh, dude, I told you. Bro, shut that door. Oh. Okay, okay. I understand why you told me not to go in there. It stinks like poopy. Yeah, I know. I literally cannot get the smell out of it. Well, uh, your girlfriend is not here, so come on, just go. I need to go to bed. I'm literally dying of tiredness. Okay, okay, dude. I guess I'll believe you. Well,
Well, see a TV man. See a speaker man. And guys, it seems like she's not even here. I honestly think that she's not cheating on me anymore, so I'm just gonna head back home. And it is getting pretty late, so I'm just gonna head to bed as well. Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. TV man literally posted a Snapchat on his story right now, and he just told me that he was about to go to bed. Hold on, guys. Let me check my Snapchat real quick. And what in the heck? Hanging out with my boo? Bro, you cannot be serious right now. You know what? I'm gonna crash my car to this house. Hey, TV man, if you can hear me, be ready, bud. I saw your story. Bro, what are you doing? I am crashing my car to your house, and speaker woman, what are you doing? Uh-oh, this is bad. I gotta run. Uh, get back here. Whoa, 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 speaker man, calm down. Get out of my house, dude. No, dude. My girlfriend's literally cheating on me with you. Hey, get out, get out. I'm gonna vacuum you. Bro, bro, bro. Okay, okay. Do not vacuum me. Maybe we can talk about this. Yeah, we can talk about this. Speaker woman is literally not even here. It was literally just a photo of me and my speaker. Dude, what? You think I'm that dumb? Oh, uh, yeah, because I was literally taking a photo with the speaker. And I was literally just playing random sounds that I found on the internet, okay? Now, your girlfriend is not here. This is literally just the only thing that was in the picture. Dude, no, no, no. You're capping to me, and I'm not dumb. Dude, literally look at my speaker. I literally had this on me just now. Okay, no, dude, shut up. You know what? I'm gonna look through your whole entire house again without you. I'm gonna figure out where the heck she is. Yeah, whatever you say, speaker man. Yeah, so here, I'm gonna check every single room real quick. And I'm gonna check your room again. And let's see. Okay, is she in here? No. She's still not in here. Oh my gosh, I have to open this bathroom. And oh my gosh, okay, that stinks. Okay, yeah, she's not in there. I don't know how anyone can last in there. Well, here, let me open this room. And no, she's not in this room either. Well, huh. Maybe she's out here on your balcony. And no, huh. I don't see her at all. See, speaker man, I told you, she is not even here. It was literally just me taking a photo with my speaker. And the only reason I called it my boo is because I love this thing to death. Like, it literally plays so much good music. Dude, I know you're lying to me. I swear I saw her here. Well, I still have a few more rooms to check, so I'm gonna check this real quick. And wait a second, this door is literally open. And look, there's literally nothing going on here. This is literally the room when my little nephews come over. Yeah, right, bud. I still haven't even checked every single room in the house. I haven't checked the downstairs yet. So I'm gonna go downstairs and I'm gonna check everything, even the fridge. You know what, speaker man? I don't even give you permission to do this. Yeah, I don't care, bro. Arrest me if you want. Well, I'm gonna figure out if my girlfriend is shitty or not. And look, there's literally nothing in here. This is literally another guest bedroom. Dude, you have so many bedrooms in your house. Please stop bro, it. Bro, what? You're literally so weird. Now, come on. Continue checking my house. There's literally no one in here. You're literally just wasting both of our time. I'm literally just trying to listen to music, dude. Yeah, right, bud. Well, here. I'm gonna go check the fridge real quick. And let me see, huh? I'm gonna see if she's inside of here. And no, she's not even inside. Well, how about over here? And wait a second. How about in these? And no, nope. she's not in there either, bro. See, I told you she's not anywhere. Well, uh, how about you just get out of this room now? Dude, why do you want me to get out of this room so much? Bro, because I think you want to steal my soda now. Get out of here. You think I want to steal your soda, bro? Okay, you know what? I'm actually gonna steal some of your soda. I'm gonna drink it because this soda is my favorite. Well, hold on. There's still some more cabinets over here, and no, I don't even think she could fit in that. See, I told you she's not inside of my house. It was literally only my speaker. Oh, uh, all right, bro. Wait a second. Dude, where did this plant come from? Oh, uh, what do you mean? I literally always have this plant speaker, man. Now, come on, bro. Just get out of my house. I'm literally so tired of you. No, 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 no. Hold on, bro. This plant looks familiar for some reason. Oh, really? So you know someone with long green hair? Wait, what? This is a someone? Oh, uh, I mean, what, what? No. Uh, I'm just a plant. Oh, come on. Wait a second. Your plant can talk? Uh, yeah. I'm a plant that can talk. Hold on. Wait a second. Look at me real quick, plant. Uh, this is my face. I'm a plant that can talk. Hold on. No. That is speaker woman. Hey. No, I'm a plant. Speaker woman, get over here! Speaker woman, run, run, run! Hey, you got me caught up! Oh, uh, what are you doing in his house? Uh, speaker man, it's not what you think! Yeah, we're literally just friends, speaker man! Yeah, right! You literally posted on her Snapchat story and he called her your boo? No, that was literally my speaker, like I just said. I don't know how this lady got here. She's literally dressed up as a plant. Bruh, stop lying to me or I'll pour this soda all over your okay, face. Okay, okay, don't do that, don't do that. I do not want this soda on my face, speaker man. She literally just came over because we were gonna bake a cake. Yeah, for your no, guys, you're lying. I'm not that dumb. And this is all adding up now. It is not even my birthday, and you are cheating on me. No, we're not. It's your half birthday. No, it's not even my half birthday. You know what, Speaker Woman? I'm done with you. Wait, wait. No, no. I can explain. April Fool's. And you know what, Speaker Man? I'm done with you. I'll sweep you out of my house. Bro, what? Oh, my gosh. It is not even April Fool's. You know what? We're breaking up, but I'm going to post this on my Snapchat story. No, don't post me like this. Yeah, whatever you say, speaker man. This is my girlfriend now. Yeah, right. Okay, here. Let me take this photo real quick. Yeah, I'm going to send this to all my one million fans. And I'm going to say, speaker woman is a plant. And she is a cheater. And ha <laughs> ha, I'm going to post this to my story. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. And guys, never cheat on anyone or you'll get exposed. She's like speaker woman. Ha <laughs> ha. See you later, speaker man. Get wrecked. Oh.
Oh, uh, this TV channel is so boring. I really wish Black Street for 24 hours was on, but it's not today. And I'm literally so bored. There's nothing fun going on. I'm just gonna get up and I'm gonna go downstairs and get something to eat. And huh, let's see. What do I have to eat? And oh my gosh. I have bananas. Yes, sir. I love bananas so much. But wait a second, bro. Are you serious? The banana is literally raw. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it right now. My whole day is trash. Wait a second. What the heck? TV woman literally just sent me a Snapchat? No way. Oh my gosh, guys. Maybe this is my chance at her dating me while here. Let me see. And it says, Gifted Girls Only Sleepover? Wait a second. What the heck? Guys, they're literally having a Gifted Girls Only Sleepover without me. Oh my gosh. You know what? I think I figured out a way to cure my boredom for the day. What I'm going to do is go over to TV Woman's house. And I'm going to go to their sleepover. And hopefully I can actually get inside. Because I'm so bored right now. And maybe when I'm inside there, I can get her to date me while here. Let me off my car real quick. And I'm going to head over to her house right here. And oh my. My gosh. I can't believe it, so I'm just gonna go up here to the front door. And wait a second, guys. Look up there. They're literally both the Skippy Girl, Speaker Woman Girl, and TV Woman. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. And I'm gonna knock on the door. Uh, hello? Knock, knock. Is anyone home? Oh my gosh, Speaker Woman, who's knocking at the door? I don't know. Let's see. Uh, hey there, Skippy Girls. Uh, Speaker Man, what are you doing here? Oh, well, I saw your Snapchat that you sent me, and I was kind of wondering if I could join your Skippy Girls only sleepover. Uh, Speaker Man, this is a Skippy Girls only sleepover. No boys are allowed. Yeah, we're serious. Did you not read the text? Yeah, I literally just sent you a snap that says no boys are allowed. Wait a second, you did? Oh my gosh, here, let me check my phone real quick. And no boys allowed, bro. Are you serious right now? Come on, guys. Can you make an exception, please? I'm so bored today. The only way we can make an exception is if you were a girl. And you're not a girl, so good day. Wait, what? Guys, hey, let me in. Oh my gosh. They just shut the door in my face. Are you kidding me? See you later, speaker man. Yeah, see ya, speaker woman. Guys, I cannot believe this right now. TV woman just said the only way that I can get inside of the skip to girls sleepovers if I became a girl. And I'm not a girl. I'm literally a man. Well, you know what? Honestly, I think I'm gonna give up. Wait in a second. She said if I become a girl, I could get into the sleepover. So what if I dress up as a girl? I sneak into the Skippy Girls only sleepover. Oh my goodness. That is such a great idea. Well, huh. Well, first I think I need to change some clothes and after that I gotta put on a wig. Because I literally got like no hair right now. Well, here, let me think. Where can I get some clothes in a wait a second? There's literally a girl's clothing store and then there's a hairdresser right next what well, I'm even thinking. Well, you know what? I'm gonna head there right now. And I'm gonna buy some girl clothes so I can sneak into the Skippy Girls only sleepover. And perfect, guys. I made it to the chick clothing store. And this clothing store is literally for girls only. So I'm gonna go in here. I'm gonna get some girl clothes. So, hey there, missies. I have a question for you. Uh, aren't you a man? This is a girl's only clothing store. I mean, yeah, I am a man. But I need some girl's clothing. Uh, okay. That's a little strange. But what are you looking for? Well, preferably girl pajamas. Oh, pajamas? We have a whole section. Follow me. Wait, really? Uh, all right. After I get these pajamas, I gotta do my hair right across the street over here. And then I can sneak into the girls always sleep over. This is gonna be insane. And here we are. You can try on anything that you would like. Oh my gosh. All right. Thanks a lot, missus. Hey guys, now I'm gonna try on some pajamas. And let's see what ones make me look like a girl. And here's my first set of pajamas. And wait a second. What the heck? This is literally a chicken onesie. Oh my gosh. You look so hilarious. Bro, what? No, I do not look hilarious. I mean, okay, actually, yeah, I do look super duper hilarious. Well, you know what? Let me find some actual good looking girl pajamas so I can sneak into that sleepover. All right, here, let me change real quick. And perfect. Oh my goodness. This looks like something a girl would wear. No way. It's literally like a pink piggy with a heart. Okay. Well, Mrs. I would like to buy this, please. Oh, those look fabulous, honey. Yeah, I know what they do. Okay, well, this will be 50 bucks. 50 bucks? Are you serious? Oh my gosh. All right. Well, here, let me scan my credit card real quick. You know, all right. Thank you. No, thank you. Have a great day. Yep, you too. And guys, now that I have my pink piggy pajamas, I can go to the hairdresser and get my hair done. And after that, I'm going to sneak into the Skip the girls only sleepover. It's gonna be so crazy. So here, let me go to the hair salon real quick. And I'm gonna get my hair done. Oh, hey there, cute piggy. Welcome to my hair salon. Uh, hey. I was wondering if I can get my hair done. Of course you can. Wait, really? It was that easy? Uh, all right. Uh, yeah, as long as you're paying me. Yep, I'll be paying you. Okay, well, little piggy, come and sit in this chair right here. All right, missus. And what do you want to do to your hair today, darling? Uh, I would like a blonde wig, please. Oh, okay. We have many blonde wig options, so I'll show you a few. All right, yeah, perfect. Okay, and here's the first option. Wait a second. Second, this is the first option, honestly. Yeah, I'm that bad. You know what? I'll actually take this. Oh, wow. That was really quick. Yeah, I know. Well, come over to this 
counter and pay me. All right, yeah, here you go, Mrs. Okay, thank you so much. Have a great day. Yep, you too. And guys, now that I have my plot of wig on, I can sneak into the skimmy curl until we sleep over. And I can try to get TV woman to date me. So I'm going to head back to my car real quick, and I'm going to drive over to her house right now. And I made it to their house, so guys, now that I'm dressed up as a skimmy girl, hopefully I can actually get inside now, and that wasn't a waste. Well, here, knock, knock, knock. Hello, skimmy girls. Are you home? Oh my gosh, that better not be speaker man at the door again. I'm literally going to be so mad. Oh my gosh, they're coming down right now. Uh, hey there, girls. Uh, girl, who is this? Um, yeah, who are you? Uh, hey there, girlies. I'm new around here. Uh, I'm speaker woman girl. Speaker woman girl? Uh, no, I'm speaker woman. Oh, I, I, I meant speaker man girl. I'm a sister. Oh, you're speaker man's sister. Okay. Well, it seems like you are a girl, so you know what? You can come into our sleepover. Wait, what? Really? I mean, wait, what? Really? No way. Yeah, girl, of course. Welcome to our town. Yeah, thanks a lot. Well, girlies, uh, can you show me around your house and, uh, what are we going to even do tonight? Well, I was thinking that we could play a lot of games tonight and we could have some frappuccinos. Wait a second. Play a lot of games tonight and have frappuccinos? Uh, okay. That sounds slay. Period, girl. Well, look at this frappuccino. Oh, this is literally so delicious. Oh my gosh, yeah, that sure does look delicious. Here, can I have a sip? Uh, yeah, girl, you can have a sip because you're a girl. All right, yum, yum, yum. Oh my Oh my gosh, uh, Frappuccino is slaying. Well, Skippity Girlies, how about we start playing our first game? Wait, what? We're playing the first game right now? Uh, all right, Curly. Yay, this is going to be so much fun. We should play Truth or Dare. Hold on, Truth or Dare? No way. Uh, it sounds like so much fun. Yeah, it totally does. I'm so down. All right, well, uh, how about let's go sit down on the couch and let's start. All right, yeah, let's do this, Girlies. Well, Girlies, who wants to go first for Truth or Dare? Huh, I think Speaker Woman should go first. What? I should go first? Uh, no. I I don't really want to go first. What? But you got chosen. You have to. Yeah, come on, girl. Truth or dare? Uh, okay, I guess I'll go first then. I am going to go for a truth. Wait a second. You're going to go for a truth? No way. TV woman, what should we make her tell the truth about? I don't know, girl. I think you should choose because you're new. Bro, what? Are you serious? Okay. Wait a second. I got a great idea. Okay. Speaker woman, you're not ready for this. Uh, yes, I am. Give me it. Well, is it true that you like frappuccinos? Oh my gosh. Yes, I love frappuccinos. That is true. Oh my gosh. This game is so much fun. I want to go next. Pick me. Okay, okay. Yeah, you can go next. And guys, these truths and dares are going to get even more insane. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Well, uh, TV woman, truth or dare? I choose dare. Wait a second. A dare. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Speaker woman, we have to choose the best dare ever. All right, yeah. Let's choose the best dare. Well, what is it going to be, speaker girl, man? Well, I think for a dare, we should make her tans on the table. Oh my gosh. That would literally be so embarrassing. And I can snap it to all my friends. Okay, yeah. TV woman, you have to dance on the table. Oh my gosh, what? No, that's so bad. Nope, you have to dance on the table. You're not allowed to back down. Yeah, and we're gonna get Snapchats of you. Oh my gosh, no, that's not fair. Yes, it is fair. Now get to dancing. Yeah, come on. Oh my gosh, say cheese to my followers. Okay, I'll dance for you. And look at me go. Boogie, boogie, boogie. Oh my gosh, you look so ridiculous. I'm gonna put her on bar filter. Oh my gosh, what? Oh my gosh, TV woman, you look so hilarious. Hey guys, I'm going to post this to my story. Yeah, I'm going to send it to everyone also. No, don't send it to everyone, speaker woman. Haha, -ha, I already did it. I'm done with that dare. All right, girly, but wait a second. Um, Speaker man just posted on his story. Wait a second, uh, he did? Wait, why is speaker man posting on his story? Oh my gosh, guys. I forgot that I had them added. I'm not actually a girl. Oh no. Hopefully they don't get suspicious of me. I have to delete my story fast. Oh my gosh, wait a second. Look at his story. Why is his sister posting on his story of you dancing on the table? Oh my gosh, why? Why did you post that on his Snapchat? Oh, uh, uh. Guys, I can explain, uh, we share our account. Oh, that makes more sense. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, I was getting scared for a second. I thought Speaker Man snuck into our girls' only sleepover. No, no, no. He would never do that. Oh my gosh, guys. That was way too close. Okay. Hopefully, I do not get exposed for sneaking into your wall here. Let me check the Snapchat real quick. And, ha, <laughs> she's dancing on the table. Ha, <laughs> ha. That was so funny. All right, guys. Well, it's my turn now. All right, Speaker Girl Man. Truth or dare? Huh, truth or dare? I want to dare. Oh my gosh, girl. You're so rebellious. Yeah, I know, girl. All right, Speaker Man, girl. I dare 
you to sing. Wait a second. You want me to sing? Uh, My voice isn't good. Trust. No, girl. I believe in you. You can sing. Bro, what are you serious? Oh, my gosh. I've never singed in my life. Well, guys, what song should I sing? How about you sing Barbie Girl? Wait a second. Barbie Girl by Barbie? Oh, my goodness. Okay, okay. Well, guys, I guess I'll sing that. I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. Oh, my gosh. You Made suck at plastic. singing. It is fantastic. Oh, my gosh. My ears are literally bleeding. Wait, what, guys? Are you serious? Please put that micro down. Please. Yeah, never sing ever again. That was literally so horrible. Bro, what? Oh, my gosh. All right. Yeah, you're just not cut out for singing. Sorry. Yeah, see, I literally told you guys. Well, it's not my turn anymore. It's your speaker woman. So truth or dare. Okay, I choose a dare. Oh, my gosh. She chose a dare. Oh, my gosh, girl. I have the most perfect dare ever. But hold on. Let me go get it. Wait, what? You're getting something? Uh, all right. Speaker woman, what do you think it's going to be? Uh, I'm not really sure. Hopefully, it's not anything bad. Yeah, that would be super duper crazy. Okay, speaker woman, I dare you to eat this whole jar of baby food. Uh, that is literally so disgusting. Oh yeah. my gosh, she ate it. I'm gonna Snapchat it. Oh my gosh, I can't back down from a dare, so I guess I'm literally just gonna have to eat that. Give me it. Yep, and I'm gonna show all of our friends that you like baby food. Ah, oh my gosh, I'm Snapchatting this right now. Say cheese. Oh my gosh, okay, I guess I'll start eating it. Oh, and oh my goodness, guys. I'm gonna send that to all of you. <laughs> Dude, this literally tastes so disgusting, guys. I do not want to eat this anymore. Well, girl, it's a dare. You gotta finish it all. What? Are you serious? Oh, my gosh. Well, it seems like there's only one more bite left, so you know what? I'm just gonna eat it. Oh. I am never eating baby food ever again. <laughs> that dare was so funny. Well, you know what, TV woman? I'm forcing you to do a dare. Oh, what? No, that's cheating. No, it's not cheating. You gave me a dare, so I'm gonna give you one. And you know what the dare is gonna be? Uh, what is it gonna be? It is going to be call your crush. Oh, my gosh, no, I'm not doing that. Yeah, you have to call your crush. No way. Come on, don't be a scaredy baby. Oh, says so it's the baby that just ate all the baby food. Oh, roasted. Hey, don't you dare ever say that ever again. You are not allowed to back down from a dare, so you have to do it. Come on, get on the couch. Ugh, this is so dumb. Well, TV woman, you have to call your crush now. Ugh, oh, right, but you already know who it is, speaker woman. Yeah, I know who it is. But it's gonna be so funny because speaker woman girl is right here. Wait, uh, guys, what do you mean? Okay, but you know I have a crush on Speaker Man. Wait, what? You have a crush on Speaker Man? Uh, guys, I, I kind of have to pee. I'll be right back. Okay, Speaker Man girl. Oh my gosh, guys, she's literally calling me. This isn't even the bathroom. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe it right now. I have to answer the phone. Uh, hey, hey there. Oh my gosh, girl, he answered the phone. Oh my gosh, say that you have a crush on him. Uh, Speaker Man, I, I have a crush on you. Wait, what? You have a crush on me? Oh my gosh, she's hung up. Wait a second. Why did I just hear Speaker Man talk in the other room? Wait a second, and that's not even the bathroom. Room. Oh, guys, this is bad. I think this is caught on to me. Oh, my gosh. Wait a second. This is all adding up. You are Speaker Man. Uh, uh guys, no, no, no. I'm not Speaker Man. Trust. Take off that pajama right now. Hey, what the heck? Hey, give me that back. I paid $50 for that. Oh, my gosh. It is Speaker Man. I knew it was you, Speaker Man. You snuck into the girls' only sleepover. Uh-oh. I've been caught. Bye. Get out of here. Oh, my gosh, guys. I literally snuck into the Skippy Girls' only sleepover. That was crazy. All right, guys, now is your time to hide. And I'm going to give you five seconds. Go. I have the best spot. Follow me, camera woman. Okay, TV woman. One, two, three, four, and five. Yes, okay, I'm going to come find you guys now. Ah. Okay, that was kind of weird. I think I might have just heard one of the girls scream. Well, whatever. Let me try to find them. Are they inside of this creepy room right here? No, they aren't. Well, huh. how about over here? And what the heck? This is super duper weird, guys. Where even are they? Well, I still have a few more spots to check. So let's see. Are they in here? Wait, what? Is this a secret room? Eh, it doesn't even seem like it opens. Well, there's a porty potty right here. So they may be hiding inside. Let me see. And wait, what? There's literally no one in here. I swear I heard the girls screaming from over here. Help us, Speaker Man. Wait a second, girls. Is that you? Yes, it's us. We fell into the toilet. Wait, what the heck? You guys are inside of there? Yeah, and now we're in some sort of dungeon. It's really deep down here. Wait, what? You guys are in a dungeon? Well, how do I get down there? I gotta save you guys. You have to jump through the toilet. I have to jump through the toilet? Are you serious right now? Oh, man. Well, guys, I guess I'm coming down. I'm gonna save you. Let's go. <sighs> Wait a second. Where am I? Wait, Skippy Toilet, what are you doing here? Where are my friends? Oh, hey there, Speaker Man. I kidnapped them. Well, why would you do that? Let them go now. Nope, they are both going to be my girlfriends. Oh, Skippy Toilet, can you please just give them back? Huh, let me think. Oh, 
Okay, how about this? You have to complete five challenges for me. And after you complete those challenges, you can only have one of your friends back. Wait, what? Only one of my friends? Yep, you have to choose to save TV woman or camera woman. Well, what are you gonna do with the one I don't choose? Well, the one you don't choose is gonna be my girlfriend. Oh, it's giving me total. Okay, well, at least I can save one of them. Well, it's giving me total. What are the challenges I have to do? Well, I have placed five of my minions around Brookhaven. And you have to talk to each one and beat them in their challenge. When you complete all the challenges, come back to me and I will let you save one of your friends. Okay, it's giving me total. I'm on it. Well, where even is your first minion? My first minion is at Brookhaven Stable. He is waiting for you, so you better get over there look at his place. All right, Skibbly Toe, I'm on it, but how do I even get out of this place? Oh, well, there's actually a door right over here. Follow me. All right, Skibbly Toe, I'm on it. And guys, honestly, I don't know how I can only save one of the Skibbly Girls. They're both my friends, but huh, I'm just gonna have to think about it later. Oh, and I finally made it to Brookhaven Stables, and where even are you, Skibbly Toe's minion? Ha, <laughs> I have been expecting you. Oh, well, there you are, Skibbly Toe's minion. What do I have to do for the first challenge? Well, for the first challenge, you have to fight me. What? I have to fight you? Yep, you sure do, and if you beat me, you get to go to the next challenge. But if you fail, then you won't be able to save any of your friends. What if I feel I won't be able to save any of my friends? Yep, so if you want to save at least one of them, then you're gonna have to beat all of my challenges. Well, Speaker Man, are you ready to fight? Oh, man, yeah, I'm ready to fight, and you're going down. Alright, we'll see about that. Ha uh ha! -huh. Whoa, what? You're doing backflips and stuff. Ha <laughs> ha get over here. Stop being afraid. Oh, man, okay, okay. I've never punched in my life, so I gotta do this fast. Uh, take this, give me all this minion. You will never defeat me. Oh, yes, I will. Come here. Uh, 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 take that. Oh, that hurt. Uh, I'm going to give you my final punch. Uh, take this. Oh. Titan Speaker Man, how did you just punch me so hard? Yes, I defeated the first Skippity Minion challenge. You sure did. Well, the next Skippity Minion is going to be at the school. Now, good luck finding him. Oh, my gosh, my back. Finding him? Okay. That is kind of weird. Maybe that next Skippity Minion is hiding from me. So, I'm going to head to the school, and then I'm going to search around for him. Uh, no, that bro. Okay, in school, so let's see. Skippity Toilet's Minion, where even are you? I'm gonna check every single one of these classrooms, and maybe he's inside of one of these, so let's see. Is he in English? And nope, he's not inside of there. And he's not inside of the science room either, and he's not inside of the gym. Well, I'm pretty sure those were all the rooms on the first floor, so I'm gonna check in the top floor, and huh. I don't see him right now, but the only enclosed areas are the restrooms, so I'm gonna go check the boys' restroom first, and let's see. Skippy Toilet, where? Oh my gosh! Oh, hello there! Oh, uh, hey, Skippy Toilet! Minion. I have been expecting you. Are you ready for your second challenge? Oh, uh, yes, Mr. Skippy Toilet's Minion. Uh, I'm ready. All righty, get your running shoes on because you're going to have to get me. Wait, what, Skippy Toilet's Minion? Where are you going? Ha, ha, ha. You will never get the next challenge. Oh, I'm going to catch up to you. Skippy Toilet's Minion, get back here. Oh, no. Where did I go? Wait, what? Yeah, where did you even just go? I was hiding in the plant, silly girls. Ha, ha, ha. Hey, get over here. Stop running. Hey, tank this basketball. Ouch. Oh, my God. Stop chucking stuff at me. You will never catch me, and you will never find where the next Skibbity Minion is. Your friends are going to be trapped down there forever. Oh, Skibbity Toilet's Minion, I'm going to catch you. Oh, take this. Oh. And yes, I tackled him. And Skibbity Toilet, you aren't going anywhere until you give me the next clue. Oh, okay. Well, here is where the next Skibbity Minion is. Let me go look at my paper real quick. Hi. Sorry, Mr. Skibbity Old Man. And uh, I actually need my glasses, so please give me a second. Bro, are you kidding me? All right, now I have my glasses. Okay, let's see what this says on this paper. Uh, it's really small, so I'm trying to read it. Okay, it says that you have to meet the next Skibbity Toilet Minion at the abandoned building. Yes, okay, the abandoned building. The abandoned building? Where could that be? Oh, uh, wait a second. That's where I played hide and seek. Why, you played hide and seek there? Uh, yeah, that's literally how this whole entire thing happened. Oh, okay, how? Huh? That's really interesting. Well, uh, have fun then. All right, Mr. Skibbity Toilet's minion and guys. I'm getting so close to rescuing one of my friends, but huh, which one should I even choose? Oh, no. This is such a hard choice. Well, I think I'm gonna have to choose later on, guys. And I'm back at the place, so let me go inside and, huh, where's the next Skippy Toilet minion? Oh, hello, Skippy Toilet's minion. Where even are you? Is he behind this tree right here? And no, he's not even behind that tree. Are you kidding me? Well, I'm gonna check all around here and let's see. He's not in the toilet and wait a second. I didn't see this toilet here before. That's kind of weird. Boom. Whoa, whoa, what the heck? Hello there, tight speaker, man. I have been waiting for you. Bro, you're literally a tree. Are you serious? Okay. You must be skipping to a third minion. Well, what is my next challenge, mister? Well, as you can see, we are at the abandoned place. So for your third challenge, you have to beat me in a game of hide and seek. You will have 30 seconds to find me. And if you find me, then you will get your next challenge. Oh, well, I'm the hide and seek master, so this is going to be easy. All right, we'll see about that. 
here. Let me change real quick. Uh, okay. All right, now I'm ready to hide. Wait a second. What? You're Smurf Cat? Well, yeah, I can turn into anything. That's why I'm the master at hide and seek. We live, we love, we lie. Guys, I cannot believe that tree just turned into Smurf Cat. That is so weird. Well, Mr. Smurf Cat, you can go hide now, and I'll count. One, two, three, four, five. And Mr. Smurf Cat, I'm coming to find you. All right, well, you're not going to be able to. What? Are you serious? All right. Well, I have 30 seconds to find him, so let's see. Is he inside of here? And no, he's not inside of here. Well, maybe this thing will open now, and no, that's not opening. Oh, man. Well, I have to go fast because I only have, like, 15 more seconds left. And he's not inside of this room. Well, maybe he's back over here in the toilet. Let me see it. No, he's not in the toilet. Oh, man. Well, maybe he's on the roof right here. And no. Well, I haven't checked this area yet, so let's see. Is he getting this fire? No, he's not there either. Well, let's see. Where could he even be? Wait a second. Guys, I don't think Smurf can't use me, but look. I can literally see his toes right here. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna tickle them real fast. And hello, Smurf Cat. I found you. Hey, who's tickling my toes? <laughs> I found you, Smurf Cat. What? Are you serious? Hey, that's not fair. Oh my gosh. I shouldn't have turned into Smurf Cat. That literally gave away my whole entire hiding spot. Well, Speaker Man, congrats on finding me. Bro, what? You're among us now? Yeah, dude. I can literally shapeshift into any meme. Anyways, that's beside the point. Your next challenge is going to be at the campsite. You have to get there quick, though. Uh, all right, Mr. Among Us. I'll get there. See ya. See you later. And guys, that was my third challenge. And I'm about to head on to my fourth. And after this, I think I'm gonna have to choose which Gibby girl I should save. Well, hopefully I can save both of them. I really gotta start thinking of a plan. And if you, I made it to the campsite fast. Well, wait a second. What is my car doing here? Oh, hello there, speaker man. Hey, you must be Skippy Toilet's fourth minion. Yep, I sure am. Well, the reason why your car is here is because we're gonna be doing a race. What, a race? Yep, and if you don't beat me in this race, then you are not going to be able to save any of your friends. Are you serious right now? Yep, I'm serious, so hopefully your car is fast enough because we literally took it out of your driveway. Yeah, I can tell. Well, I have the fastest car in all of Brookhaven, so I'm gonna win. All right, we'll see about that, speaker man. And if you win, then you only have to go against one more minion to save one of your friends. Now remember, you can't save both of them. Yeah, I know. And now let's get ready to race. All righty, I'll give us the countdown. Three, two, one, go! And we're off in wait a second. What? How are you beating me? Because my car is the fastest in Brookhaven. Yours isn't. Oh, uh, well, trust me. I'm gonna beat you. Hey, wait a second. How are you in front of me? Hey, get back here. <laughs> Take the L. Oh, no. I see the finish line right up there. You better not make it. Oh, trust me. I'm gonna make it. Let's do this thing. Hey, why are you swerving in the road? Hey, let me pass you. Uh, Get over here. Oh, no. You can't pass me. Hey, you're literally slowing me down. You better not make it to the end of the road. Come on. I'm so close to the finish line right here. Come on. Come on. Come on. And yes. I just won. What? Are you serious? You weren't supposed to beat this challenge. This was supposed to be the death of you. Oh, man. I can't believe it. Well, Speaker Man, you did win the challenge fair and square. So it seems like you'll be able to go to the fifth minion. Yes, I knew I did it. Well, Mr. Scary told us, minion, where is the fifth minion located? The fifth minion is going to be at the bank. The bank? Okay, that is pretty weird. What is he doing at the bank? I don't know. You're gonna have to go figure out. Okay, bye-bye. All right, well, see ya, Mr. Skippy Toys Minion. Thanks. I guess I'll just drive my car there. And now I made it to the bank, but why do I even have to be here? I mean, it doesn't seem like anything's happening. Ha, ha, ha. Now it's time for me to escape. Wait a second. Hey, what's going on up here? Wait, what? Hey, Skippy Toys Minion, that's my car. For your fifth challenge, you're gonna have to catch me and take the money back. What? How? I don't know. You're gonna have to think of a plan. Bye-bye. Bro, are you serious? That's my car. Oh, my gosh, guys. I gotta catch him somehow, but how can I do that? Uh, I want ice cream so bad. Wait a second now. Hey, girl, get back here real fast. Huh? What'd you say, mister? I said get off your bike. Hey, give me back my bike. Thanks a lot. I'll give it back after. I'm sorry. I feel so bad for the little girl, but I have to save the Skippy Girls. And where even did this guy go? Oh, hey there, speaker man. It seems like you found a bicycle. Yeah, I found a bicycle. Get over here. Oh, you're not gonna catch me. Uh, trust me, I will. Yeah, we'll see about that. I'm gonna run you over. Wait, what? Oh, no, you are. Oh, uh, you thought, boy. Get over here. Hey, no, you better not go anywhere. Give me that money. Nope, you have to catch me. Uh, take this. And yes, I got the money in. Oh, wait a second. Uh, Mr. Are you there? Where is Skippy Toilet? I literally defeated all five of the minions. Well, you already know where he is. You were literally in his bunker. Oh, my gosh. My back hurts so bad. Congrats on beating the five Skippity Toilet minions. Now you have to go save one of your friends. But remember, you can only save one of them. Wait, but what if I want to save them both? You already know that you can't save both of them, guy. Well, here, let me go talk to Skippity Toilet first. And hopefully I can make a plan to save them both. So let me go down here and Skippity Toilet. I complete all five challenges. So now let me get the Skippity Girls out of here. Well, Speaker Man, I told you, you can only get one of them out. So I'm going to let you inside of the room and you 
have to pick to save TV woman or camera woman. Now, good luck choosing speaker man because the one you don't pick is gonna be with me forever. Oh man, all right, Skibbity Toilet. And hey, girls, wait, what? Are you guys all right? No, we're not all right, speaker man. We've been dropped on here for hours. Oh man, guys, I feel so bad for you. Yeah, you should feel bad. Well, you can only save one of us, so who are you saving? Guys, honestly, this is a super hard choice, and I want to save you both. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna figure out how to save you both. Wait, what? How are you gonna do that? Well, I'm gonna look around and see what I can do. Just hang tight, guys. All right, speaker man, hopefully you'll be able to do this because I really don't want to be Skibbity Toilet's girlfriend. Yeah, but... I know. Well, let's see. There seems to be a wire right here. And, oh, uh, wait a second. I think this turns on your guys' lasers. So what if I take this gun right here and I shoot that box right there? Yeah, that's a good idea. Maybe if you shoot the box, the lasers will turn off. Yeah, and you could save us both. Oh, yeah, I'm a genius. Well, here, let me grab the gun and I'm gonna shoot the box. Oh, take this box. Oh, well, it works. Yes, well, guys, now we have to get out of here fast before Skibbity Toilet realizes. All right, well, Speaker Man, how are we supposed to do that? Well, Camera Woman, you're gonna stay down here so Skippy Toll thinks I only chose one of you guys. And once Skippy Toll opens the hatch, you're gonna run out and escape. All right, Speaker Man, that sounds like a plan. Well, I'm gonna be hiding right here, and I'll run up right as he opens it. All right, yeah, you do that. Well, TV Woman, let's go up right now so you can get out of here. Okay, let's go. So let me open up the hatch real fast, and Skippy Toll, I have chosen TV Woman. All righty, Speaker Man, congrats on saving one of your friends. Well, it seems like Camera Woman is going to be my girlfriend then. Bye-bye. Ah, -bye. Uh, guys, let's get out of here. Yeah, well, let's run fast. Hey, get back here. Where are you going, camera woman? Everyone hop in my car. Let's escape. Oh, my gosh, speaker man. I can't believe that plan worked. You've really <laughs> saved both of us. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem, guys. I'm glad both of you guys are safe. Guys, this party is so lit right now. Yeah, look at my dance moves. Oh, oh, oh. Well, TV man, those are awesome dance moves. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, yours are also pretty good, TV woman. Aw, thank you, guys. Well, we've been dancing for a while now, guys, so do you want to play a game? Oh, yeah, I would love to play a game. Oh, well, sorry, guys. I actually can't. I gotta go. Wait, what? Uh, TV woman, why are you leaving? Wait a second, TV woman, get back here. We're supposed to be partying for the whole entire day. Dude, she's already gone. What the heck? That was the weirdest thing ever. She literally just got up and left. Yeah, I know, dude. That was super duper weird. I I wonder why she left. There's literally nothing that she has to do. Yeah, there sure is. And she literally told us earlier today that we were going to party all night, bro. Yeah, bro. Well, do you just want to go inside and play some games by ourselves or like dance or something? No, bro. I don't think we should do that. Honestly, I think that we should go follow her and we should go spot on her and figure out all of her secrets because I think she's hiding something from us. Wait, really? You think she's hiding something from us? Yeah, bro. I really think she is. No person will just stop partying mid party. Yeah, that is pretty true, Speaker Man. Well, we can't let her see us because we need to find out all of her secrets. So let's just go to her house and sneak. Around. Yeah, we sure can, bro. So, you know what? I think we're gonna have to go to the disguise store and get some disguises. And after that, we can figure out where she is and spy on her. All right, Speaker Man, that's a good idea. Let's go to the disguise store. Yeah, let's go, bro. And now we're at the store. And wait a second, uh, little Timmy, what are you doing here? Oh, hey, Bo. Uh, I actually work at this job now. Wait, what? You got fired from the other job? Uh, no, I didn't get fired from the grocery store. I just work like 50 jobs now. Holy macaroni, dude. That's insane. Yeah, I know it is. But, uh, welcome into the store, guys. What do you guys need today? Well, Timmy, we're looking for a disguise. Uh, all right. What kind of disguise? Guys, do you guys need? Literally, like any disguise, little Timmy. Uh, okay, well, do you guys want to be in like a unicorn onesie or some girl clothes? Or maybe you could dress as a turtle. Uh, TV man, what do you think? Dude, I think we should do girl clothes or something like that. Because we'll probably blend in. What girl clothes, really? Oh my gosh, all right. Well, little Timmy, I think we need some girl clothes. All right, boy, that sounds good. Well, uh, go over there to the girl's clothes, Evan. You can try some on. All right, thanks a lot, little Timmy. And little Timmy, uh, I'll take the unicorn onesie. You just gonna give me the girl's clothes? Dude, the unicorn onesie is a girl clothes. Oh my gosh, bro. All right, well, here, let me put on some girls' clothes clothes real fast. Yeah, what the heck am I wearing? What even is this? Well, Speaker Man, you're looking really fancy. Dude, I cannot believe that girls wear these clothes. This is so weird. Well, we have to find out TV Woman's secrets. So you just have to dress up like that, bro. Oh my goodness. All right. Well, let me just put my onesie on. And there we go. Now I'm a unicorn. Your outfit is better than mine. Well, little Timmy, I guess we're ready to purchase these outfits. Well, guys, it's actually my birthday on the job today. And it says I can give someone a discount if I really want to. So you know what? I'm going to give you guys a discount. Everything is free. No, wait, really? Well, Timmy, thanks a lot. Lot, bud. Yeah, no problem, bro. Well, Alright, wish you guys the best of luck figuring out TV Woman's secret. Thanks a lot, bro. So, TV Man, let's go head over to her house so we can start spying on her. And hopefully we can figure out all of her secrets. Yeah, let's go. And, bro, now we're at her house and, wait a second, what is she doing right there? She's on the couch and, wait. Do you see what she's drinking, bro? Bro, are you serious? She literally left the party to drink a Frappuccino at home watching a pig on a TV. Well, bro, let's just spawn her and see what she does next. Oh my gosh, this Frappuccino is so good and that piggy is so cute, but my stomach is really starting to hurt. Uh oh I gotta go to the bathroom. Wait a second, bro. Why did she run upstairs? Oh, no. I think she's going to the bathroom. Mm -hmm. 
her. Uh, bro, did you just hear that? Yeah, I think she really had to go to the bathroom or something. But I wonder why. Yeah, me too, bro. Well, wait a second. She was drinking a Frappuccino. Oh my gosh, I think I'm lactose intolerant. Wait a second. What did she just say? She said she's lactose intolerant. What does that mean? Uh, dude, I'm pretty sure that means when you drink milk, you really have to go take a massive poop. What? Are you serious, speaker man? Yeah, bro. I'm actually totally serious. Well, why did she come home and decide to drink a Frappuccino just so she could go to the bathroom? Bro, honestly, I have no idea, but at least we figured out one secret that she has. But I'm still thinking that she has a lot more. Yeah, I think that too. So let's try to figure out all of Well, them. speaker man, we can't really see much from this window. So how about we sneak inside? Bro, what? You want to sneak inside of here? Yeah, I mean, she's in the bathroom right now. So let's go. Come on. We don't have much time. Yeah, bro. That's true. Wait a second. What? We can literally just walk inside of her door. Oh, man. Her door isn't even locked. Okay, bro. Here, let's just sneak into her bedroom real fast and perfect. Now we can spot on her even better. Hopefully, we can figure out more secrets about her. Yeah, hopefully we can, bro. And hopefully she gets out of that bathroom soon. Yeah, hopefully she does. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad that thing is all over. But now we have to go meet up with a secret boy. Wait a second. Did you just hear it, bro? A secret boy? Are you serious? Okay, speaker man, that just really got me angry, bro. A secret boy? What is she gonna do with that secret boy? She better not be going on a date. Yeah, bro, but there's only one way to find out. We have to go follow her. <sighs> all right, bro. Well, I'll try not to get angry, but I might actually get really angry. Yeah, bro, I'm sorry, bro. Here, let's sneak outside real fast. And let's see if the coast is clearing, bro. Okay, it is. Well, we're gonna have to round there, and hopefully she hasn't left yet, because we're gonna have to follow her car. So let's go outside and let's see. Wait a second, bro. She's driving away right now. All right, perfect. We need to follow her car. Yeah, we sure do. Look, she's going this way. Oh my gosh, I wonder where she's going. Yeah, me too. Hopefully she's not going to Brooks Diner. I can't wait to go to Brooks Diner to go on this date. Wait a second. Did you just hear that? Oh my gosh, she's going on a date with somebody. Bro, I feel so bad for you. I'm sorry that she's cheating on you. And she's also going to Brooks Diner. Oh my gosh. But we still have to spy on her because we have to figure out more stuff that she's hiding from us. Yeah, bro. We have to figure out all of her secrets. So let's go to Brooks Diner. And bro, now we're at Brooks Diner. So let's go spy on her. Speaker man, honestly, I don't want to spy on her for this one because I do not want to see her cheating on me. Bro, what? Are you kidding me? But you're literally my right hand man. Well, speaker man, I don't want to see my girlfriend sitting with some random person. She's literally my girlfriend, bro. That's really going to hurt my feelings. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess it will, bro. All right. Well, you can go somewhere else, but I'm still going to spy on her. All right, I'll just be waiting at the pool then. Come out whenever you're done. All right, bro. I'll let you know. Well, guys, now let's go over here and let's go see. Wait a second. Is that Skibbity Toilet? And wait, what? TV Woman? No way. TV Woman's cheating on TV Man with Skibbity Toilet. Oh, hey there, Skibbity Toilet. You're looking really nice today. Oh, you're looking really nice also, TV Woman. Well, I'm so happy that you decided to go on this date with me. We are going to have so much fun. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe this is happening. Yeah, I can't wait to do that thing later today. Wait a second. What thing are they talking about? Huh, this is really, really suspicious. Yeah, it's going to be so much fun. I cannot wait for it to happen. Well, Skibbity Toilet, now that we planned that thing for later today, I'm going to go back home. Wait a second. You don't want to eat any food? Uh, no. I'm going to go home and prepare for the thing that's happening later today. Oh, uh, okay, TV Woman. Well, uh, good luck. Wow, she is so beautiful. Oh my gosh, guys. I cannot believe that just happened. And she's going home right now. Oh my gosh, she's right there. And phew, she passed me. Okay. As I was saying, I cannot believe that just happened. I really wonder where the thing is later today. Uh, hey, there's Skibbity Toilet. Uh, Speaker Man, what are you doing? And why are you dressed as a girl? For no reason, okay? Oh, okay, Speaker Man. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, wait, what the heck? Okay, guys, that was kind of weird. Why did he just laugh like that? All right, whatever. Well, I'm going to head over to the pool so I can tell TV Man about what just happened. And then we're going to go back to finding secrets about her. So, hey, TV Man, bro, I have an update for you. Oh, what happened, Speaker Man? Tell me, bro. So, dude, when I was following them, Skibbity Toilet and TV Woman said they're going to be doing something later today. What? It was Skibbity Toilet? And they're going to be doing something later today? Oh, my gosh. What could they be doing? That sounds so sus. Yeah, dude, it sure does sound sus. Well, I guess we're just going to have to wait to find out. But in the meantime, bro, let's go back to TV Woman's house so we can figure out more of her secrets. Yeah, that's a good idea, Speaker Man. Let's go. And, bro, we're back in her house. Yeah, so let's just go up to this window and spy on her and see what she's talking about. The first thing I gotta do to prepare for the big thing today, I gotta go gun shopping. Wait a second. She has to go gun shopping? What big thing are they preparing for? Dude, I have no idea. But well, that is even more suspicious than, wait a second, bro. She's leaving right now. Quick, hide in the trees. Okay, phew, I don't think she saw us. Yeah, me neither, bro, but wait a second. We gotta go follow her to the gun store. Yeah, quick, let's follow her. And bro, look, she's walking inside right now. Oh my gosh, this is so bad, dude. I really wonder why she's purchasing this gun. Yeah, me too. You know what, Speaker Man? I'm fed up with this. I'm going to go confront her. Whoa, wait. No, 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 bro. You cannot confront her. We still have to figure out all of her secrets and what the big thing is happening later today. Oh, okay, Speaker Man. Well, let's just see what she's doing up here. All right, yeah, bro. Let's see. Hello. I would like one gun, please. Alrighty. What kind of gun do you want? Uh, I was 
thinking maybe a shotgun. Uh, a shotgun? Are you serious? A shotgun? What the heck? What could she be using this for? I have no idea, bro. All righty, one shotgun. Come right up. All right, thank you so much, Mr. Telecom Man. You know, oh my gosh, bro. She's coming down. Quick, hide. Hurry, get out of your speaker, man. Oh, no. <laughs> I cannot wait to use this bad boy. Bro, did you just hear that? She just said she cannot wait to use this bad boy. But oh, no. We have to watch out. She's going to see us. If you, I don't think she did, bro. But wait a second, bro. Where is she going? I have no idea, bro. Here, let's follow her. Oh, my gosh. She's literally running all over the place. And I think she's teaming up with Skibbity Toilet to do something really bad later, bro. Yeah, bro. I think that, too. Well, bro, her car's right here, so that must mean she's back here in this alleyway. Yeah, she probably is, but, bro, we can't go back there because she's gonna see us. So let's just sit right here and see what she's talking about. Yeah, bro, good idea. Hello, are you the person I buy the tank from? Yep, I sure am. All right, perfect. I would like one of your strongest tanks that you have. Wait a second, bro. Do you hear her? Is she buying a tank right now? Why does she need a tank? This is really suspicious, dude. All right, it's gonna be $1 million. Ooh, that is a little pricey, but luckily I have the money. Uh, what the heck? How she have the money? I don't even know, dude. I think it's like Skibbity Toilet's money or something. Yeah, it probably is, bro. All right, perfect. Well, here are the keys to the tank, and you can pick it up at the car dealership. All right, thank you so much. Hey, bro, she's coming to run fast. Hide. Oh, my gosh, bro. How did she see us? And look, oh, my gosh. Okay, thankfully, she did not see us. Yeah, thankfully, she didn't. Well, bro, that was literally like five secrets we've already just found out. Yeah, bro, and they're all adding up to something. This is really suspicious. At first, she was drinking a Frappuccino on a couch, and she was lactose intolerant. And then we figured out that she went on a date with Skibbity Toilet. And then she bought a gun, and now she bought a tank. Yeah, bro, they also said that something's gonna happen later today. And I'm assuming that it involves the guns and the tanks. Yeah, bro, me too. Well, let's just keep following her and investigating. And then when the time comes, we're gonna have to stop her shenanigans. Yeah, we're gonna have to, bro. Let's go. And it seems like she's at the car dealership. Okay, quiet down. All right, bro. Well, let's see. Wait a second. The tank is right there, and there she is. And perfect. I have the last piece to my puzzle. Time to initiate the plan. Wait a second. You just hear her, bro? She's initiating the plan here, hi. Oh my goodness, I cannot believe that she's in the tank right now. Yeah, and where is she going? Oh no. She said she's initiating the plan. Yeah, and wait a second, bro. She's going towards our houses. Oh my goodness, bro. This is bad. Yeah, dude, it sure is here. Let's go see her car real fast and let's follow her. Hopefully my house isn't gonna get harmed. Wait a second. We're stealing her car? Yes, bro. It doesn't matter. Let's go. Hey, bro, look. Wait a second. Why is she outside of my house? Oh no, bro. And she literally just went inside. Dude, this is so weird. What is she doing inside of there? I don't even know, bro. And why do you have your door unlocked? She literally just walked inside. Bro, honestly, I don't even know. I swear I always lock it. Wait a second, bro. What if she's meeting up with Skibbity Toilet at my house? Uh, bro, why would Skibbity Toilet be inside your house? That literally makes no sense. Oh, hey there, TV woman. Oh, hey, Skibbity. It's so great to see you. Wait a second, bro. Bro, do you just hear that? I'm pretty sure Skibbity Toilet is inside of my house. Bro, how did he even get inside of your house? Dude, I don't even know. I think he, like, broke the lock in my door or something. All right, well, quick, let's get inside and let's go spy on that. Yeah, bro, that's a good idea. Well, TV woman, are you ready to initiate the plan of destroying Toilet City? Yep, I'm so ready. Let's do it. Dude, oh my gosh. Even man, we have to stop her right now. Yeah, bro, they said that they're gonna destroy Toilet City. This has been her secret all along. Yeah, bro, this is literally her final secret. There are literally, like, seven secrets we found. Oh my gosh. Well, bro, you go inside the room and confront them. And I'll stand out the door to make sure they don't escape. All right, bro, yeah, you do that. So I'm just gonna walk up and, hey, guys, what are you doing inside my house? Oh, hey there, speaker man. We were just in your house to say one last goodbye to it because we were gonna explode it with a tank. Huh? What? Are you kidding me? No, we're not kidding you. We have a tank outside of your house. Yeah, I saw. I cannot believe this is happening. You know what? I literally came here to stop you guys. Uh, speaker man, you don't have a gun or anything. How are you gonna stop us? Well, it doesn't seem like that you guys have a tank anymore. Wait a second. Who just said that? Was that TV man? No way. I'm pretty sure TV man just stole your guys' tank. Oh my gosh, my precious tank. Ha <laughs> ha, see ya. Oh my gosh, no, our tank come back. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe that that just happened. Oh my gosh, Speaker Man, how did you know about our plan? Because we were spying on TV One all day to figure out all of her secrets. And we figured out that you guys were planning something. We also figured out that she was lactose intolerant. What? No one is supposed to know my biggest secret. Wait a second. <laughs> and I won. Yes, sir. Bro, what? Oh, you always beat me. Yeah, I know. Well, whatever, Speaker Man. I'm getting a little bit hungry. I'm just gonna go make something to eat. All right, bro, but wait a second. I'm pretty sure there's nothing in my fridge. Yeah, what the heck? Why don't you have any food inside your fridge? Well, dude, because because all I eat is apples and bananas. Oh my gosh, Speaker Man, you love bananas so much. Well, since you don't have any food, let's just go to the grocery store and then we can get some. Oh, honestly, dude, that's a good idea, but wait a second, TV Man. I literally do not have any money, bro. What? You don't have any money? I don't have any money. Then how are we gonna get the snack?
snacks. Are we gonna steal or something? Honestly, speaker man, I think Timmy's working there today, so I don't think he'll care. Yeah, hopefully he doesn't care. Well, TV man, let's head to the grocery store and let's steal some snacks. And now we're at the grocery store. Hey, Timmy. Oh, hey there, bro. Hey, hello, Timmy. Don't mind us. We're just getting some snacks here. I'm just gonna be playing video games on my grocery store computer. Bro, what the heck? Okay. Oh, well, TV man, what snacks should we get? Should we get some Doritos? Yeah, let's get some Doritos and let's also get some pizza. Oh my gosh, I love pizza so much. Yeah, me too, dude. Well, let's get even more Doritos and uh, let's see what beverages do they have. Look at this. There's an energy drink. Oh my gosh, that looks so delicious. Okay, I'm grabbing one of these. Yeah, me too. And oh my goodness, dude, look, Coca-Cola. Just be quiet. You're really loud. Okay, I'm sorry, dude. Whoa, TV man, let's just walk back here and hopefully the store's open. Let's see. Can we get out of here? Oh my gosh, TV man, come quick. Oh my gosh, okay, hopefully Timmy doesn't see us. Ah, uh, wait a second, guys. Where do you just go? Uh oh, I think he realized that we're gone. Uh, what are you guys doing inside of here? Oh, uh, hey there, little Timmy. Uh, we're doing nothing, bro. Oh, uh, yeah, bro. We're doing nothing. Hey, wait a second, bros. What do you have inside of your hands? Oh, uh, this? Yeah, nah, yeah. This is nothing, bro. I think we already had this from our house, right? Oh, uh, yeah. We actually bought this from our house, little Timmy. We didn't steal it from your store or anything. Ah, uh, bros, are you sure about that? Because I literally saw you guys on the security cameras taking everything. I was not playing video games on my computer. I'm not even able to do that. Instead, I was literally spying on the cameras. Uh-oh. Oh, uh, well, uh, Timmy, it's not what it looks like. We thought this was the entrance to leave the store. Yep, yep. Uh, we sure did, and we were about to pay. All right, guys, I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. Now come back inside and pay for the groceries. Oh, uh, okay, little Timmy. Yeah, well, I guess we can go pay now. Well, uh, Speaker Man, what are we gonna do? Dude, I think we're gonna have to make a run for it. All right, I'll distract him, and you take all the stuff. All right, bro, I will. Come on, guys, pay already. All right, little Timmy, here I come. So, uh, how much is it gonna be, little Timmy? Well, it seems like it's gonna be about $30. $30? Okay, I don't have that money. See ya. Hey, wait a second, where are you going? Speaker Man, you weren't supposed to say that out loud. Yeah, I'm calling the cops on you guys. Wait, what the heck? You're calling the cops? Yep, I'm calling the cops. Oh my gosh, this is not good at all. All right, well, uh, I gotta go, little Timmy. See ya. Hey, get back here, bro. Oh my gosh, Speaker Man, we gotta hide fast before the cops arrest us and bring us to prison. Speaker Man, why would you do that? Bro, what? What else was I supposed to do? I said I was gonna distract him and you would run out silently. And you literally screamed and said you didn't have enough money, bro. Oh my gosh, yeah, I probably shouldn't have done that. And dude, I have a bad feeling that we're about to get arrested. Yeah, me too. We will, we will. You guys are under arrest. Wait a second. I think I heard that voice before, bro. Oh, no. Don't tell me it is. What? Speaker Man and TV Man? What are you doing? Oh, my gosh. It's TV Woman. Wait a second. Uh, TV Woman, why are you a police officer? Because that's my new job. Now, why have you robbed the grocery store? Well, we were pretty hungry and we had no money. So, we had to steal from the grocery store. Oh, man. Well, I'm so sorry to tell you guys. We guys are both under arrest and going to jail. So, hop in my police car. Wait, what? We're both actually under arrest? Wait a second. Are you serious, TV woman? Oh, my goodness. I cannot believe that. We're going to jail. Sorry, guys. I just have to do my job. Oh, man. It's all right, TV woman. While we're in jail, do you think we should try to escape? Yes, yeah, Speaker Man. Let's try to escape. That is such a great idea. And, guys, now we are here. Oh, well, all right. Uh, Speaker Man, there's a lot of barbed wire here, bro. Yeah, there sure is. Well, dude, I think we should just hop out and make a run for it. All right, yeah, that's a good idea. Uh, ready? Three, two, one, go. Yeah, let's go. Ha ha, see you, TV woman. Hey, guys, get back here. I'm gonna tase you. Wait, what the heck? You're gonna tase us? Okay, okay, do not tase us, TV woman. Please do not do that. Yeah, that's what I thought. Now you guys have to go into the jail. Wait a second. Did you just lock the gate on us? Oh, my goodness, bro. Oh, I guess we're just gonna have to try escaping later. Yeah, bro, we have to find some different ways. Come on, boys. I don't have all day. Okay, TV woman. Okay, we're following you. Don't worry. All right, guys. Well, welcome to your new home. Wow, this home is so cozy. Now sit down so I can take your mug shot. Oh, all right. Well, I guess we're gonna get our mugshot photos taken. That's correct. Now, don't smile. Okay, I won't smile. And there you go. Now you are a new member for the jail. Yep, I guess I'm a new member of the jail. Oh, my gosh, Speaker Man. I knew we shouldn't have robbed that place. Bro, well, I should have said it. All right, and you're also a new member of the jail. Hooray! Oh, my gosh, TV Woman. Well, TV Woman, is there any way that you can get us out of here? Like, we have to go home and live our lives. Come on. Yeah, TV Woman, help us. No, sorry. I cannot do that. I am a member of society, and I have to keep you in the jail. Dude, honestly, I think she's going to try her hardest to keep us in jail. Yeah, bro, it sure does seem like that. Well, guys, it's time to go into your cell and don't even think of escaping. Uh, all right, TV woman. Well, let's see. Where are our jail cells? Your cell is just this way. Uh, all right, I get cell 11. And TV man, do you get this cell with me? Yep, you guys have to be in a cell together. What? Are you serious? Hey, I own my own cell. Sorry, but we don't have any room. We cannot do that. Oh, my gosh, TV woman. I can't believe that she turned into a police officer, dude. Now we're literally stuck in TV woman's prison. Yeah, we sure are, and dude. We're going to have to try to escape out of here. Yeah, because we cannot live here for the rest of our lives. But look at this speaker, man. Look at what 
I have. Bro, what? You got the Doritos? Wait a second. I do as well. Yes, sir. So I guess as long as we have Doritos inside of this jail, then we'll be fine. Yeah, dude, but honestly, I think we should start trying to escape out of here because I do not want to stay in here for long. Hey, you're not allowed to have forbidden items. Wait a second. Uh, TV woman, what are you saying? Those chips are not permitted for the jail. Wait a second. You're going to take my Doritos away from me? No. Hey, hey, hey. Yes, both of you. Empty all your pockets. What? Empty our pockets? Oh, man. All right. Well, it seems like I have to get rid of my Doritos, pizza, energy drink, and Coca-Cola. Yeah, mine too. Here you go, TV woman. Thank you so much. Yep, no problem. But don't worry, boys. Dinner will be soon. Oh, dinner will be soon. Oh, my gosh. That's going to be so disgusting. Well, let's try to find a way out of here, dude. I don't want to be here anymore. Yeah, me neither. Well, here. Let's check the toilet real fast. And no, the toilet does not malfunction. Well, here. Maybe there's a secret hole under the bed. And no, nope. there's literally no secret hole under the bed, dude. Well, maybe there's like an air vent. Nope, there's not even an air vent. Oh, my gosh. There is literally no way to get outside of this prison. They made this really well. Yeah, they sure did. But, dude, we have to keep on trying. And hopefully soon we'll be able to get out. Yeah, well, uh, maybe we could call skibbity toilet like through the toilet or so oh, skibbity toilet uh dude i don't think that's how it works oh uh, whatever well since we have no way to get out i guess we'll just sit here and wait really all right dude well dinner is gonna happen sooner or later so we might as well just wait attention everyone it's time for dinner wait a second you hear that bro it's already time for dinner oh my gosh i'm so excited i wonder what we're gonna eat is it gonna be a steak and mashed potatoes oh my gosh that'd be so delicious or maybe it's gonna be chicken and gravy uh boys don't get your hopes up this food isn't very good Ew, what in the heck is that Wait a second. We have to eat this. Oh, my gosh. What is this? It's your yummy, yummy dinner. Oh, uh, TV woman, this does not look yummy at all. It looks like poo and broccoli. Yeah, and nobody likes broccoli. Well, it's actually toast, mashed potatoes, asparagus, and chicken. You guys are lucky you actually get food. Some of these prisoners don't. Wait, are you being serious? Uh, okay. Well, uh, TV woman, how about this? After we eat our food, you tell us how to get out of here, and we just escape. Yeah, can you do that for us? Uh, no, that's not how prison works. Oh, my gosh, TV man. You can't keep asking her if we can escape. Because she's never going to let us. Yeah, bro, I guess that's true. But I'm just literally trying to find any way that we could get out of here. Yeah, that's a good idea. Well, bro, I think we should start out in the showers. And maybe there's like a secret vent in here. Let's see. Oh, well, it seems like they actually built this pretty well. Yeah, they sure did. There's no secret vents anywhere in here. Oh, man. Well, let's keep on checking around. Hopefully, we can find somewhere to escape soon. Yeah, maybe we could check the trash cans. Maybe there's like a ladder inside of here. What? A ladder? Are you serious, bro? Why would there be a ladder inside of the trash can? Oh, uh, I don't know. I'll just make it an assumption. Well, it doesn't seem like there's anything in these trash cans. All there is is literally barf. Oh my gosh, that smells so bad. Oh yeah, it sure does. Well, wait a second. Look right here. There's a kitchen, so maybe we can walk inside of the kitchen. And maybe there's like an exit in here. Wait a second, speaker man. That's a great idea. Okay. Well, let's just walk inside of here and oh my gosh. Dude, there are literally so many boxes and wait a second. Why is the ceiling so high? Oh my goodness. Look. There is a ventilation system. Yes, let's go. Wait a second, boys. Why are you in the kitchen? Wait a second. How do you know that we're here? Because I heard you scream, TV man. You're so loud. Oh my gosh, I shouldn't have done that. Wow, thanks a lot, TV man. We were so close to escaping. Wait, you guys are trying to escape? What? No, we're not trying to escape. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. We are not trying to escape. We were just coming inside of here so we could get some boxes and open up some more food and eat some more food because I was really hungry and I needed to poop and I needed to fart. Yeah, I agree with what he said. Oh, well, I'm sorry, but that's not how prison works. Oh, wait a second. You're gonna put us in handcuffs? Yes, you guys are going back to your jail cell. Don't ever try to escape. Hey, let me go. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe that this is happening right now. And you guys are both going to be in different jail cells this time. Could you guys keep trying to escape? Wait, what? Are you kidding me? No. Hey, wait. No, I want to be in a jail cell with Speaker Man. Well, you guys have shown me that you can't do that. Oh, my gosh. You're literally the worst cop in the world, TV woman. Well, sorry. You should not break any laws. Oh, man. I cannot believe that we're back in the jail cell. Well, TV woman, when is the next time that we can come out of here? Well, in a few minutes, you guys can go to the courtyard and play some basketball. In a few minutes? Oh, all right. Well, I guess I'm just going to have to sit here and wait until it's time. All right. And you guys don't ever think about it escaping because you're going to be locked up here for a whole entire year. What? A whole entire year? Oh, man. Oh, guys, little does she know that TV Man and I are going to try to escape once it's time to go to the courtyard. Hey, Speaker Man. Wait a second. Is that you? Yes, it's me. Can you hear me? Yeah, I hear you through the walls. Well, do you have any plans to sneak out of here? I was thinking once it's time for us to go to the courtyard that we can go in there and then climb over the humongous wall. All right, Speaker Man, that's a good idea, but there's also barbed wire, so we have to be careful. Yeah, we sure do. And if that doesn't work, I think we should try the kitchen way again. All right, yeah, that's a good idea. All right, boys. It's time to go to the courtyard. Wait a second. Already? Yep. I only said it was going to be a few minutes. Uh, all right. Well, TV man, let's go to the courtyard. Let's try to hop the fence. Yeah, let's do it, speaker man. And welcome to the courtyard. 
Oh my gosh, are you serious? Dude, these walls are so big. But we still have to try to get out of here. And if this doesn't work, we're going to have to try to escape through the kitchen route. Yeah, these walls are literally gigantic, dude. I don't know how we're going to be able to get out of here. Well, uh, thank you so much, TV woman. We're going to play some basketball now. Okay, you boys better behave. All right, yeah, we will. Well, TV man, let's look around the courtyard. And let's see if we can escape. Well, wait a second. Look right up there. There's literally a door there. So maybe I can like bounce her ahead and then I can open the door and then I can get you out of here. All right, that's a good idea, Speaker Man. Yeah, try to jump on my head, bro. All right, but wait a second. I can't jump on your head. Are you serious? Oh my gosh, okay. Well, uh, let's see. Maybe we can climb up this basketball hoop. Okay. Yeah, let's try it. Wait a second. We can't. Are you kidding me? Oh, man. Whoa, hold on. We have basketballs in our hands, so maybe we can shoot it at the door and then the door will open. But Speaker Man, how are we supposed to get up there after the door opens, bro? Uh, honestly, I got no idea. Well, Speaker Man, these walls are way too high. I thought they were going to be way shorter. So it doesn't seem like the courtyard strategy is going to work after all. Which means that we have to go back to the kitchen, but we have to be very, very sneaky this time. Yeah, we sure do. Because I do not want to be in here anymore, dude. I'm literally losing my mind. Yeah, well, let's try to sneak to the kitchen. And hopefully, we don't get caught while escaping. All right, yeah, let's go. All right, so let's just sneak out here real fast and let's see if the coast clear. And yeah, it is. All right, perfect. Well, here, let's go ahead to the kitchen real fast and make sure to be quiet. Because we're literally bad at escaping here. Let me pick my head inside of the kitchen. And oh my gosh, there's no one in. Come on, fast. All right, speaker man, I'm not going to yell this time. All right, yeah, you better not. Well, let's hop in this vent real quick. And oh my goodness. We can literally get out, bro. Uh, speaker man, there seems to be an issue. Shh, dude, quiet down. What is I'm it? I'm too tall to get inside of the vent, dude. Just squeeze inside. I'm trying, but it's literally so hard. Okay, let me try to get inside. And, uh, All right, I made it through. Don't worry. I'm not worrying, dude. Well, oh my gosh. What the heck just happened? I literally fell all the way to the ground, bro, in this muddy pit. Oh, this is so disgusting, but I do not think this is a muddy pit. I think this is literally poop. What the heck? Oh my gosh, yeah. I guess that's where all the poop ends up. Well, here. Grab a flashlight from the ground and let's try to get out of here. Yeah, let's look around. Oh my gosh, this is literally a maze, dude. Yeah, it sure is. Well, look, there's a vent right here, so maybe we can hop inside of here and, oh man, where even are we right now? I think we're in like an air conditioning room. Yeah, I don't even know, Speaker Man. Well, let's see. Is there a door? And okay, there's a door. And dude, this would literally bring us right back to the jail cell, so let's not go inside of there. Let's go back into the vent. Well, we have to get out of here fast before TV woman figures out that we're not there. Oh, Speaker Man! Shh, dude, quiet down! Come over here, bro! We can get out! Wait, what the heck? We can get out? Uh, alright, where? Look at this! There's literally an elevator! You ran right past it! Well, dude, how are we supposed to get in? Look, it literally requires a key card. Well, Speaker Man, when we were in the courtyard, you said you could use the ball to open up the door. So, uh, I decided to bring a ball with Wait, me. Wait, what? You brought a ball with you? Well, I did too. Oh, well, uh, great might think alike then. So, I guess if we just throw it at the lock right here, it should just open. Yeah, let's try and wait a second. Oh my goodness, it worked! Yes, yeah, Speaker Man, we're gonna escape TV Woman's prison! Shh, dude, be quiet. Uh, boys, quit your time is done. Uh, where did they go? Oh my gosh, dude, I think she just realized. Oh no, this is not good, Speaker Man. Well, uh, we gotta get going. Well, dude, let's head to the bottom floor fast. Code Red, Code Red, lock down the prison. Wait a second, they're locking down the prison. We gotta get out of here, come on. Oh my gosh, bro, run, run, run. <laughs> and yes, we made it outside, but wait. We still gotta get over these fences somehow. Oh no, okay. Well, uh, let's see, how can we get over? Oh no, this is so bad. Here, I'm gonna try to jump over. No, I can't jump over. Wait a second, look right here. Maybe we can jump over here. And wait, what? No. Oh no, Speaker Man, this is bad TV. Well, it's right there. Hey guys, where do you think you're going? Well, I have a basketball, so I'm gonna chuck it right here. And open the gate, quick, let's go. Oh my gosh. No, 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 get back here. I don't wanna get fired. Well, TV Woman, it seems like you're gonna get fired today. Your prison is horrible. What? Yes, Titan Speaker Man has been born. You're gonna have such a great life. Yes, Mom, I'm gonna have the best life ever. Did I just hear that Titan Speaker Man was born? Hey, where are you going? I'm gonna kidnap your son. No, Mom, save me. Speaker Man, come back. Mom, help. Oh, I'm taking your son. Wait a second. Huh? Take that. Oh. Oh, my gosh, Mom. Thank you so much for saving me. Now, quick, son. We got to get home fast before he wakes up. Oh, all right, Mom. Wait, who even is that guy? His name is Skibbity Toilet. He's my worst enemy. Oh, my gosh. Well, what are we supposed to do about him? When you get older, you have to train to defeat him. What? I'm going to have to train to defeat him? Oh, my gosh, Mom. All right. Well, I'll train to defeat him so I can save you, Mom. All right, son. But for now, we got to go back to our house. All right, Mom. Let's go do it. And finally, we made it home. All right, Mommy. Well, this house is so awesome looking. Yeah, I know. And Skippy Toilet won't be able to find us here. Yeah, hopefully it won't, Mom, because if he does, that'll be super bad. You guys thought you could hide? Ha, ha, ha. Tank mode activated. Oh, uh, Mom, who is that? Is that Skippy Toilet in a tank right there? Yes, he's found us. Oh, Skippy Toilet, take that. Oh, the sound waves. Holy mackerel, Mom. 
I'm destroying Skimmy Joy. He has to get out of here. Well, I'll be back to take over the world. Wait, what? Did he just say he's going to take over the whole entire world? Yes, son. That's why when you get older, you're going to have to be able to defeat him. Oh, my gosh. All right, Mom. Well, that's super bad. So I guess when I'm older, I'm literally going to train so much. And then I'm going to defeat Skimmy Joy and save the whole entire world. Well, right now, I'm just a baby, so I can't really do much. Yeah, you can't. And it's getting late, so it's your bedtime. Come on, let's go inside. Wait, what? Mom, it's my bedtime. Are you serious right now? Oh, my gosh. All right, well, I guess I'll just go upstairs. And uh, is my bedroom up here? Yes, your bedroom is up here. Oh, all right. Do I get this humongous bedroom right here? No, no, no. You get this bunk bed in here. Wait, what? Are you serious? A small bunk bed? Oh, my gosh, Mom. All right. Well, I guess I'll just go to bed. And once I get older, Mom, I can literally train to the feed skip the toilet and save the whole entire world. Yes, you can, buddy. Now go to bed. Uh, all right, Mom. Good night. Ugh, good morning, world. Today is going to be so awesome. But I first, I have to go downstairs and say good morning to my mom. Hello, Mom. Good morning. What's for breakfast? Oh, good morning, Titan Speaker Man. Uh, I don't have any breakfast in the fridge, so you're going to have to go run to the store. What, Mom? You don't have any breakfast in the fridge? You literally say the last waffle. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, my gosh. All right. Well, I guess I'll just go run to the store. Wait a second. What the heck is that? Open on up, Titan Speaker Man. Oh, my gosh, Mom. Skimmy Joel came back with, like, five tanks. Oh, my gosh. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Wait a second, Mom. Since I'm older now, I can literally try to defeat him. Uh, I'm going to get you, Skimmy Toilet. No, you're not strong enough yet. Oh, oh, oh take that. Uh, oh, my gosh, Mom. That hurt. Oh, no. Speaker Man. Oh, 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 my work here is done. See you later. Speaker Man, are you all right? Mom, look at me. Do you think I'm all right? I'm literally hurt on the ground right now. Oh, my gosh. Well, okay. We're going to have to go to the hospital. I told you you weren't strong enough yet. Yeah, I know, Mom. But maybe once I get out of the hospital, you can train me to the feet. Skibbity toilet. Oh, yeah. I guess I can. But for now, we just got to go to the hospital and get you better. Yeah, all right, Mom. Yeah, let's go to the hospital. Doctor, please help him. All right. What seems to be the issue here? Oh, nothing really. I only just got shot by a humongous tank. What? You got shot by a tank? Hank, are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious right now. Okay, oh no, this is really bad. Uh, follow me to this room right here, and I'm gonna fix you on up. Don't worry. Doctor, is he gonna be alright? Uh, I'm not really sure, but uh, I think he will. Yeah, hopefully I will, because I really kind of trained to feed Skibbity Toilet. Wait a second, did you just say Skibbity Toilet? Yeah, I said Skibbity Toilet. I have to train to feed him, because he's been terrorizing my family for years. And he said he's gonna take over the world. Oh, I hate that Skibbity Toilet guy. He's always causing havoc. I wish one day someone can defeat him. Well, let me go ahead and let me grab my supplies and okay, we're good to go. All right, Doc, well, what do you think I'll be better? Well, Titan Speaker Man, it may take a few years. What? A few years? But, Doctor, we don't have a few years. Well, I'm sorry, Titan Speaker Woman, but your son got shot by a tank, so you're just gonna have to hold off on defeating Skibbity Toilet for a few years. What? Are you serious right now? Well, can I train at least? Nope, no training is allowed. You're gonna have to wait five years. What? Five years? Oh my gosh, that's so bad. Uh, I can't believe it. Skibbity Toilet's gonna take over the world. Well, hopefully he won't, Titan Speaker Woman. Well, Titan Speaker Man, it seems like you're all good to go. Oh my gosh, all right, Doc. I really wish I could train right now so I can defeat that stupid skimpy toilet. I don't like him at all. Yeah, I know you don't like him, but you're just gonna have to wait. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna have to wait literally five years to train. Are you kidding me? Bye-bye now. Good luck. Don't worry, Titan Speaker Man. Everything will turn out okay. Yeah, hopefully it will, Mama. Well, let's go back home and I'm just gonna go straight to bed. Uh. Trust me, Titan Speaker Man. Five years will fly by and you'll be able to defeat him in no time. Yeah, hopefully I will, Mom, because I still have a lot of training to do. Well, I'm just gonna head to bed. All right, good night. Oh, uh, good night. Son, wake up. It's time to start your training. Wait a second, Mom. Today is the day? Today is the day. No way, Mom. I've been waiting so many years just to start my training today. Yes, sir. I cannot wait to defeat Skimmy Toilet. I know. You've been waiting five years just for this day. Yeah, I sure have, Mom. And after you train me, I can literally defeat Skimmy Toilet once and for all. And I'll stop him from taking over the world. Yeah, you sure will. Well, let's go to the training grounds and let's start your training. All right, Mom. Yeah, let's go to the training grounds and I cannot wait to train. <laughs> Skimmy Toilet is going down. And son, here is our training ground. Oh, uh, mom, we're just gonna be training on this rock right here? No, silly, we're gonna be training all the way up there. What? All the way up here? Are you kidding me? Holy mackerel, mom. All right, well, I guess I'll try to go up and whoa. Oh my gosh. This is so steep, so I just gotta do this real fast, and hopefully I can get up without falling. And come on, come on. Yes, I made it up, but mom, it is literally so tight up here. Yeah, there's not a lot of room, so we have to be super careful that you don't fall off. Yeah, we sure will. Well, mom, now that we're up here, can we start by training, please? Yes, of course we can. All right, Mom, well, what are we going to be doing? I'm going to teach you how to fight. So whenever you see Skibbity Toilet, you can take him to the ground. Really, Mom? All right, that sounds awesome. Well, what do we start off with? Well, first, we got to do some stretches, so just follow me. Uh, all right, Mom, and wait, what? How are you even doing that? Oh, my gosh. Here, let me try and, uh, okay, that is not working. Hold on here. Let me try again. And, oh, my gosh, Mom, look at me. I'm literally copying you. Hey, you're getting the hang of it. Yeah, 
Yeah, I know, Mom. I guess I'm just a fast learner. Yeah, you sure are. Well, we can step it up a notch. Now we're going to do some jumping jacks. Jumping jacks? Okay, Mom. Well, here, let me try jumping jacks. And, uh oh, okay. Why am I not doing it? Oh, my gosh. Here, let me try it again. Come on, I got it. Yes, sir, Mom. Look at me. Wow, great job. Thanks a lot, Mom. Well, what's next? Well, now I'm going to teach you how to fight. And after that, I'll teach you how to use your sound wave powers. My sound wave powers? Oh, my gosh. Okay, Mom. Well, how do I even fight? Well, you want to put one fist in front of the other, just like this. Uh, all right, Mom. Here, let me try. Try that. And mom, look at me. I'm literally so good at it. Yes, you sure are. And now it's time to use our sound wave powers. Sound wave powers? Oh my gosh. And after I learn this, I can literally defeat Skibbity Toilet. Yes, you sure can. And to use your sound wave powers, you have to combine everything and use your speakers. Combine everything and use my speakers? Uh, okay, mom. Here, let me try this. So let me do my jumping jacks real fast. And let me do some punches. And now I can use my speaker powers. Ow! Wait a second, Mom. Are you all right? Oh, my gosh, Mom. I'm coming down for you. Oh, man. I'm so sorry, Mom. I didn't mean to do it. Oh, oh, oh. I thought I heard you guys somewhere. Wait a second. Skippy Toilet, what are you doing here? Maybe quiet down with those sound waves next time. Oh, Skippy Toilet, I'm not scared of you anymore. I know how to fight. Psh, whatever you say, Titan Speaker Man. Uh, you're going down. Uh, take my sound waves. Uh. <laughs> this is what you get. Oh, that that really hurt, but I won't go out without a fight. What? He's back up? <sighs> whoa, whoa, whoa. You really think you can fist fight me? Uh, you're going down. Uh, uh, take my punches. Oh, why are you so strong? Yes, I defeated Skippy Toilet. Uh, oh, man. Wait a second. Oh, my gosh, Mom. I forgot all about you. Are you all right? No, I need some help. Bring me to the hospital. Uh, all right, Mom. Here. Crawl over to the tank so we can bring you to the hospital. Fast. Oh, all right, son. Hurry, quick. Mom, I'm going as fast as I can. Hold on. We're going to make you feel so much better, Mom. Come on, come on. We're at the hospital, so let's go inside. Hey, doctor, hurry. Help my mom fast. She just fell off a huge building. All right, I'm on it. Get to the room. All right, Mom, you're going to be okay. Trust me. Uh, I'm not feeling too good, son. Come on, Mom. Just lay down on that bed. All right, let me get my supplies. Come on, doctor. You got to save my mom. Son, if I don't make it, I just want to let you know I'm proud of you for defeating Skibbity Toilet. Mom, trust me. You're going to make it. Yeah, don't worry. You're gonna make it. Don't worry. Just be okay. Be okay. Mom, come on. Make it. Oh, I love you, son. No, Mom. Oh, Titan Speaker, man. I'm sorry for your loss. Oh, boys. Finally, I finished school for the whole entire day. I cannot wait to go home and just relax. Oh, hey, Speaker Man. Oh, uh, hey there, Speaker Woman. What's going on? Uh, I have a question to ask you. A question? Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. What is it? Will you be my boyfriend? What? Will I be your boyfriend? Uh, no. Sorry, Speaker Woman. I'm not looking for a girlfriend right now. What? Are you serious? Oh. Well, I'll get you to love me. Trust me. Oh, uh, okay. Whatever you say. Well, I'll see you later. All right. Bye. Uh, boys, that was kind of weird. I didn't really know that speaker woman had a crush on me, but and whatever. I'm just going to head home now. And uh, finally, I'm back home. I cannot wait to go for a swim. I love swimming so much in Tronimo. Oh, uh, hello, speaker man. Can I come and swim with you? Uh, speaker woman, what are you even doing at my house? Uh, I was asking if I could come swim with you. Well, now, I'm sorry. I like to swim by myself. Oh, man. Well, can we hang out, maybe? Uh, honestly, speaker woman. You're kind of weird, but huh. I guess we can hang out just for a little bit. Really? Oh my gosh. Okay, let me come in. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, you can come in. And speaker woman, what do you even want to do? Huh, let's play a game like truth or dare. What? Truth or dare? Really? Yep, really. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Okay. Truth or dare is one of my least favorite games. Well, who wants to go first? Uh, I can go first. All right. Well, truth or dare? Uh, dare. Okay, well, I dare you to jump inside of the pool. Okay, that's such an easy dare. Wait, what? You're actually going to do it? Oh my gosh. No, wait, no. Way. Geronimo! Oh, no! You just jumped in the pool! Yay! I love the pool! Alright, now it's my turn! Okay, Speaker Man, truth or dare? Oh, huh, how about a dare? Okay, I dare you to kiss me! Hey, yo, wait! No, 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 no! But you have to do it! It's part of the game! No, no, no! Get out of my house right now! You're creepy! Or just a kiss on the cheek! No, Speaker Woman! I am not gonna kiss you! You're weird! Get out of my house! Come on! I have the biggest crush on you ever! Yeah, I know it! I don't have a crush on you! Here, get out right now! Or I'm gonna force you out! Okay, fine. I'll be back to get your luck. All right, what have you say, Speaker Woman? And guys, this Speaker Woman girl is so weird. She literally scared me to kiss her. Hey, guys, honestly, I think I'm going to have to get my mind off this. So I'm going to tell my friend TV Man to come over. And hopefully he's able to hang out. Oh, uh, hello, TV Man. Do you want to come over and hang out? No, I'm busy right now. What? Are you serious? You're busy? No, no, no. Please come over right now. Uh, okay, it seems urgent. Well, I'll be over in a few minutes. Oh, all right. Thanks a lot, TV Man. A few moments later. Hey, Speaker Man, I'm here. Oh, TV Man. Perfect. Bro, I need to tell you about something.
love thing. Okay, what is it? Well, this girl speaker woman has the biggest crush me ever. And she's super duper creepy, bro. What? How is she creepy? Can people just not have crushes on people nowadays? No, dude. She tried to dare me to kiss her. What? Are you serious? Why were you playing truth or dare? I don't know. I just was. Well, did you kiss her? No, dude. Why would I kiss her? I don't even like her. She's just so crazy. Yeah, that is pretty crazy. Well, do you want to go upstairs and play some video games or something? Yeah, I guess we can, TV man. All right, let's play Blast Screen for 24 hours. All right, TV man. Let's play it. And oh my gosh, TV woman, shh, be quiet. He's right there. Wait a second. Uh, do you hear that, TV man? Yeah, I do. It kind of sounds like someone whispering. Yeah, it does. That's kind of weird. Well, uh -huh. I'm going to go check around the house. Maybe someone broke in or something. Uh oh, TV woman, I got to hide. Wait a second. I think I just heard something again. It kind of sounded like a girl. Yeah, I heard it too. Well, let's check every single room and see if the house is clear. And let's see. Wait a second. Speaker woman, what are you doing in my house? Hey, get out of his house. Oh, hey there, speaker man and TV man. Hey there, speaker woman. What are you doing back in my house? I thought I kicked you out. Uh, this is your house? I thought it was my house. Bro, are you serious right now? Speaker woman, this is literally my house. Can you please stop stalking me? Yeah, speaker woman. He doesn't even like you now. Get out of his house. But I have a crush on him, please. No, speaker woman. Get out right now. Well, at least take my flowers. Uh, no thanks. I do not want your flowers. Here, I'll take your flowers now. Please get out of the house. Um, this is not fair. Oh, well, yeah, it is fair. Because you're a stalker now. Stay out. Man, she sure is crazy. I see what you're saying now. Yeah, you see that? She is literally the craziest person I ever met. Do you have a trash can or something that I can throw these away in? Uh, no, I don't really, but you can chuck it in the fireplace right here. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. And now, TV man, let's get back to our game in peace. Wait a second. Do I hear the ice cream truck? Yeah, I think I hear that, too. Hey, free kisses for speaker man. Hey, yo, what? That is not ice cream. And we also have ice cream, too. What is she doing on a hill? I have no idea. Idea, TV man. Hey, speaker woman. What are you doing up there? I don't want your ice cream or kisses. Well, I bought this truck because I know you love ice cream. I mean, yeah, I do, but I don't want your kisses. You know what, speaker man? I'm tired of me giving you my free kisses. How about we marry each other already? Wait, what? Marry each other? No, no, no. I'm not gonna marry you, speaker woman. Oh, yes, you are. Trust me. Oh, <laughs> uh, dude, that was super duper weird. Yeah, that was super duper weird. And TV man, I think we should just, like, go outside because she keeps coming back to the house. So let's just go outside and let's go to the stores and stuff. And oh my gosh, okay, that was close. You run this way fast. She literally almost just ran you over, bro. Yeah, I know. Well, let's go to the store over here so we can hide from her. Speaker man, we can hide in the back of the store. She'll never know that we're here. Yeah, that's a good idea, TV man. Here, let's hide straight behind here. And perfect. She will never know that we're here now. Uh, I cannot wait to get food for my wedding. Speaker man is going to love me so much. Wait a second. Are you serious? Speaker woman's right inside of here. She just said she's going to get food for our wedding. What? Are you serious right now? She thinks that you're going to marry her. Yeah, I know, dude. This is so bad. We gotta do something about it. Well, we can't blow our cover because she's gonna go crazy again. Yeah, that's true. So I think we're just gonna have to wait it out until she leaves the whole entire store. And after that, we can figure out where the wedding place is and we can ruin it all. Hello, this is all. Thank you. Bye. And wait a second. She just left. We have to follow her to the wedding place fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta follow her fast. Okay, uh, where did she even go? Wait a second. Look over there, Speaker Man. She's in her ice cream shop. Oh, look. There she is. Quick, let's follow her to the wedding place. And Speaker Man, look over there. Oh, I can't really see what's happening. Here, take my binoculars. All right, thanks a lot. And oh my gosh, TV man, look at her. She's all dressed up. She really thinks that she's gonna marry me right now. Yeah, she even has flowers. Oh yeah, she does. Oh, uh, where's the priest? He should be here any moment. Wait a second, the priest? Isn't that the guy that's supposed to marry people? Yeah, I think he is. And wait a second, look, there he is. What the heck? Skibbity priest is right there. Oh, hello there, speaker woman. Are you ready to get married? Yes, I am so ready. All right, well, where is your husband? Uh, he should be here any moment. What did she say? Any moment? Oh my gosh. I gotta crash this wedding fast, but what should I do? Wait a second. The ice cream truck is right there, and she is right there. So are you thinking what I'm thinking, TV man? Yeah, I think I am. What if you hop in the ice cream truck and run her over? Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. So I gotta get out of the binoculars, so I gotta sneak over there to the ice cream truck. And once I'm at the ice cream truck, I gotta hop in the front seat. I'm gonna run her over. Okay, okay. So I gotta sneak just like this. And look, there he is. He's arrived. Oh no, she literally just saw me. Uh, hey there guys. Hello there, husband. Oh, is this the person you're gonna get married to? Yes, yes it is. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Priest, but I really do not want to get married to her. She's super duper crazy. What? I thought you guys were dating. What? No, we're not dating. She's been trying to kiss me and marry me all day. What, babe? Stop lying. You know you love me. No, TV woman. I don't like you at all. So do you want to marry this girl or not? No, pastor. I do not want to marry this girl. What, babe? I literally spent $10,000 on this bridge. 
streets. We're getting married. No, we are not getting married. I don't care how much money you spend. And I don't care for anything you do because you're so creepy. Uh, get married to Muriel. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Put that away. And I need my money. Well, ask her for your money. Now, come on, speaker man. Marry this lady already. I really need my money. Yeah, you better marry me. Honestly, guys, I've had enough of this. Speaker woman, I don't know why you have such a big crush on me, but I don't like you at all. And guys, honestly, I'm done. I'm gonna hop in this ice cream truck and I'm gonna run you over. What? You're gonna run me over? Oh no, let me move out the way. Yeah, you heard me crack, speaker woman. Now get ready. Uh oh, I gotta run. Get set. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Oh, you're gonna get ran over. Get over here right now, speaker woman. Oh my gosh, no! And yes, I ran her over. That's why you get for being creepy and crazy and stuff. I will get married to you in the afterlife. Hey, yo, what the heck? Ah, TV man, this video gave me so much fun. Yeah, but I'm getting pretty hungry, speaker man. Yeah, honestly, now that you say that, I'm getting super hungry as well. Well, do you have any food inside your kitchen? Uh, I'm not really sure. Here, let's go see real quick. Well, huh? We got some apples and bananas right here. Do you want that? Uh, no, not really. That doesn't look good to me. Yeah, me neither. Here, let me check the fridge and there's nothing inside. Bro, what are you serious? Oh my gosh. I literally got no good food in my house. Yeah, you don't. You should have gone grocery shopping or something. Yeah, I know, dude. Well, wait a a second that just gave me an idea uh what's your idea speaker man dude what if we literally went to little timmy's store and then we got some food from there you know what speaker man that's a good idea let's just go get some food at little timmy's store yeah dude let's go do it and tv man we made it to little timmy's grocery store so let's go inside and let's see oh hey there little timmy oh hey yeah bros what's going on we were just playing some video games and we got super duper hungry so now we need some food oh okay boats take your time all right thanks little timmy well tv man what do you want oh uh, well i obviously don't want apple and banana because i already didn't want Want that at your house. But look, there are some Doritos. Okay, I'll take these Doritos. Oh, yeah, Doritos are the best gaming snacks. And wait a second. There's pizza as well. No way. Uh, oh, my gosh. Okay, well, I think I'm gonna get the pizza and the Doritos. Yeah, me too. And, Speaker Man, are you gonna be paying for this? Oh, uh, wait a second, dude. I thought you were gonna be paying for this. Uh, no, I didn't even bring my wallet. Brian, I didn't even bring mine either. Oh, my gosh, Speaker Man. Well, we gotta get this food somehow. Yeah, we really do. I'm starving right now. Well, how are we gonna get it? Honestly, I think we just walk out the front door and and, uh, act like we don't have anything. Dude, are you serious? Oh, my gosh. All right, well, hopefully little Timmy doesn't get mad at us. All right, little Timmy. Well, uh, we didn't find anything that we want, so we're gonna walk out of here. Yep, yep. Uh, we haven't found anything. Sorry, little Timmy. Wait a second. Speaker Man, why do you have the windows in your hand? Oh, uh, uh, these? Oh, my gosh, Speaker Man, are you serious? Hey, Timmy Man, and what do you have? Oh, uh, I don't have anything, little Timmy. You can check. Ah, uh, okay. It doesn't seem like you have anything. But Speaker Man, why are you trying to steal? Dude, uh, uh, accidents happen, you know? Uh, you know what? I'm calling the police. You better stay right here. Wait, what? You're calling the police? Oh, my gosh. Why did you have the Doritos out in your hand? Bro, because I was literally hungry. Well, you could have bought them out a little bit later. We didn't even get outside the store yet. Oh, uh, yeah. I guess that's true. I'm sorry. Wee, 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 wee. You guys are under arrest. Wait a second. Who is that? That is not a regular cop. Oh, uh, what the heck? Boys, you are under arrest. Camera, Camera woman. woman. Yep, it is me, and I am a cop. Now, put your hands behind your back, mister. You guys are going to jail. Wait a second, we're actually going to jail? Yep, you shouldn't have so sorry. Wait, what? Are you serious? Oh my gosh. Well, I can't believe that we just got arrested by Camera Woman. Yeah, me neither, bro. This is crazy. Well, Camera Woman, where are you taking us? I'm taking you to my Camera Woman prison. What? A Camera Woman prison? Yep, and we're almost there. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Hey, dude, I think we should try to escape out of here. Yeah, that's a good idea. We are not going to be in here for long. Well, uh, it seems like we're at the prison now. And you know what? I'm going to make a run for it. Yeah, me too. Hey, no, get back here. Uh, oh, wait a second. What the heck? Did you just tase him? No, speaker man, come over here if you don't want to get tased. Uh, okay, I'm sorry, camera woman. Oh, my gosh, guys. This is probably going to be harder than we think. Now, come on. Get up and walk back over there. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I will never try to run away ever again, camera woman. Yeah, you better not. Now, let's go inside. All right, uh, let's just go inside then. All right, well, camera woman, what are we going to do first? Well, first, you got to get your mug shots taken. Are mug shots taken? Oh, my gosh. Hopefully, my mom who doesn't see this. Oh, trust me, your mommy will see it. Bro, are you kidding me? All right, speaker man, say cheese. Oh, cheese. And there you go. Now, TV man, it's your turn. Go sit down. All right, TV man, you're up, dude. Uh, okay. All right, TV man, say hip, hip, hooray. Hip, hip, hooray. Aw, so cute. Your moms are gonna love these photos. Yep, they sure will. Well, camera woman, what do we have lined up for today? Well, first, you guys gotta go to your jail cells. Uh, all right, well, what are we gonna do after that? You guys are gonna sit in there and relax. Wait, what? Are you serious? We aren't gonna have lunch or anything? Well, later you'll have lunch, but you guys gotta sit in there and think about 
about what you did. Oh my gosh, okay. Well, Speaker Man, how are we supposed to get out of here? Dude, there must be like a secret exit out of here. Maybe like through a ventilation system or something. Oh huh, yeah, that's a good idea. Well, let's start looking around for that. Let's see. Is there anything at the roof? And no, there's not. And there's nothing under the bed. Oh my gosh. Oh, well, maybe there's something in the toilet. Look here, let me step on it real quick. And oh my gosh. I just fell into the toilet. My cheeks are wet now. Oh, Speaker Man, that's literally disgusting. Well, there's literally no way that we could get out of this jail cell. So you know what? I'm just gonna run to the door and hope something happens. Here we Wait, go. Wait, Oh, bro, are you okay? Oh, well, it doesn't seem like I can break through that door. It's pretty heavy. Yeah, it sure seems like it. Well, it doesn't seem like we're gonna get out of this jail cell anytime soon. So we might as well just sit here forever. Dude, come on, TV man. We gotta keep on trying, bro. I really wanna escape out of Cameron Roman's prison super duper badly. Well, then, Speaker Man, how about you find a way to get out of here? Because I have no more ideas. All right, dude. Well, you know what she said? She said that we're gonna have lunch today. So maybe when it's lunchtime, we can literally distract her and then escape. All right, yeah, that's a good idea, Speaker Man, but I guess we just have to sit here. Yeah, we could yell for her. Hey, camera woman, I'm starving up here. Can we have lunch? Oh, you guys are being such babies. You've only been there for like five minutes. Yeah, I know, but I'm super duper hungry. That's literally why we stole. Yeah, we literally stole from the store because we were super duper hungry, but wait a second. Speaker Man, I still have pizza and Doritos. Hey, wait a second. Where'd you get those? Oh, uh, what, 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 what happened? Boys, empty your pockets right now. Oh, uh, all right. Well, you kind of stole all my food. Oh my gosh. I can't believe that you just caught my food. Yeah, that's what I thought. Never try to smuggle food in here again. Yum, 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 yum. Wait, what? You're eating his Doritos? Oh my gosh. Hey, Camera Woman, what is lunch? Lunch is in one minute. One minute? I don't think I can wait one minute. Oh my gosh. I want to break down the door again. Bro, what the heck? Oh, wait a second. Uh, how did I just open that? Guys, it's time for lunch. Uh, dude, I'm pretty sure she just opened it. Well, uh, what do we have for lunch today, Camera Police Officer? It's Camera Woman Police Officer to you. Oh, okay. Sorry, Camera Woman Police Officer. Well, we have this really yummy grub. Ew, what in the heck is that? Some toast, mashed potatoes, sweet potatoes, and green beans. Oh my gosh, this literally looks so disgusting. It's just Thanksgiving leftover from a little while ago. Bruh, Thanksgiving was so long ago. Well, they're delicious, so eat them. Oh my gosh, all right. But of course, I'm not going to be eating that. I'm going to be eating my Doritos. Oh, well, I guess I'll just eat this. And oh, uh, this is really good. Can I go get seconds? Uh, there should be a little more left. I guess you can. All right, perfect. Thank you so much, Speaker Man. Come on. All right, uh, Camera Woman. I'm going to go with him, too. All right, boys. Don't get into trouble. Yep, we won't. Oh, TV Man, too. Do you think there's a secret exit somewhere back here? Yeah, I think there might be. Let's look around for a vent, huh? Maybe there's something inside of here. Yeah, maybe there's one, huh? There's a whole lot of boxes right here. But there's no boxes on this one. Wait a second. Dude, look right there. There's a vent. Oh, my gosh, Speaker Man. This is perfect. We can finally escape this prison. No way. This is so awesome. Are you ready, bro? Let's get out of here. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Uh, boys, what is taking so long? It shouldn't take that long to get some food. Uh, oh, dude. I think she's on to us. Boys, where are you? Hey, you're not allowed to be back here. This is a restricted area. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, sorry. We thought that the leftover food was in here. Uh, right, Speaker Man? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, dude. Well, no prisoners are allowed back here. The leftover food is in the food right here. Oh, uh, silly us. Excuse me, man, dude. We're gonna have to come back to this later because I'm pretty sure this is how we can escape. Yeah, me too. Well, uh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, let me just grab this extra food again and okay, this is gonna be delicious. Yep, it better be delicious and I'm gonna watch you eat it all. Wait a second. You're gonna watch me eat it all? Uh, well, actually, I'm not that hungry right now. I just want to save this for later. Nope, nope, nope. You gotta eat it all right now. Oh my goodness. I can't believe it. Well, I'm just gonna eat mine right now. And, ugh, that is so gross. Well, boys, now that you ate so much food, we gotta go outside and burn off some calories. Oh, all right, perfect. I do not want to eat that food much longer. Yeah, me too, Speaker Man. Well, dude, let's go outside and, uh, Camera Woman, what are we gonna be doing out here? You guys are gonna be playing some fun basketball. Some basketball? All right, this is fun. Wow, well, this is the best thing we've done all day. This is so much fun. Yeah, it really is. Well, here, let me grab the ball real quick, and I'm gonna score more hoops than you. All right, yeah, whatever you say. Look at me. I've literally not missed once. Bro, wait. I'm literally missing all mine. Are you serious? Oh, my gosh. Dude, this is not fun. Well, guys, I'll leave you to it. Oh, my gosh. Okay, camera woman. Now that she's gone. You think there may be a way to get out of the prison from the courtyard? Uh, I don't really know, Speaker Man. The walls are pretty high. Yeah, they sure are, dude. Now that I think about it, I don't think we have a chance at escaping over here. Well, let's see. Maybe we can look around, and maybe there's something that we can grab. Wait a second. Look at this. I just got a wrench. Hold on. You found a wrench on the ground? No way. Maybe we could use that to open the vent. And after we open the vent, we can literally escape out of Camera Woman's prison. Oh my gosh, Speaker Man, that is a great idea. Well, how about we get going?
going right now before camera woman sees us. All right, yeah, that's a good idea, dude. So come on, speaker man. We have to make a sprint for it. All right, yeah, let's go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are you going, boys? It's time for your shower. Oh, my gosh, dude. She literally caught us. Uh, camera woman, we were actually running to the shower because we already knew it was time for the shower. Yep, and you guys are so stinky. Get in there. Okay, I'm sorry, camera woman. Dude, she literally just caught us again. Oh, my gosh. I think we should fake having a shower. And then we're going to have to sneak out of here. But I'm pretty sure she's literally guarding the door. You know what, speaker man? We might just have to make a run for it. That is probably our only chance to get out of here. Yeah, it sure is. Well, here, dude. Let me walk out the door real quick. And let me check around the corner. And oh, my gosh, dude. The coast is clear. Okay, speaker man, come on. We have to go. All right, yeah, let's go. Oh, my gosh. So we have to walk into the kitchen in here. All right, let me try to do this right here. Let me get the screw over here. Come on, come on, please. Dude, come on, open it already. And yes, it's open. Quick, get inside. All right, oh, my goodness. We're literally in the ventilation system. Yeah, we sure are. Well, uh, how are we supposed to get out of here? Dude, I have no idea. There are literally so many tiny vents in here. Well, how about we take this vent right here? Let's see if we can get out. All right, yeah, that's a good idea. Well, uh, dude. It literally has brought us to the storage room real here. Let's go check around it real quick and see. Maybe there's a way to get out and no, there's nothing back here. Maybe there's someone over here. Let's take a look. Yeah, let's go see and wait a second. Dude, look at this. There's literally an elevator right here, but we don't even have a key card. Yeah, it seems like we're literally locked out of this. Well, let me see. Maybe I could use my wrench to try to hack it. So let me just turn this just like this and oh my gosh. I opened it. Wait, did he really? No way, bro. Quick speaker, man. Let's go up a floor. All right, yeah, let's go up. And whoa, what is up here? It seems like we're in some type of security room. Yeah, it sure seems like that. Wait a second. Camera woman's right there. She's walking towards us. Oh my gosh, this is bad. Oh, boys, are you done your shower yet? Oh, uh, yeah, we're done our shower. Okay, well, where are you guys? I don't see you. Oh my gosh, speaker man, okay. Let me try to open this door to the outside roof. Come on, dude, open it already. And yes, it's open. Oh my goodness, no way. Hey, what was that noise? Oh no, commencing lockdown. Oh my gosh, TV man. We gotta get out of here fast. But wait a second, she literally locked the gate. Oh no, this is not good. I think I actually just set off an alarm or something. Dude, this is not going to wait a second. She is right behind us. Hey, boys, what do you think you're doing? Camera woman, we're uh, getting out of here. Oh, get out of here fast. Come on, come on, open up, gate. And oh my gosh, the gate isn't opening up. Hey, I'm coming down. Come on, dude. Open it with the wrench. All right, I'm trying, I'm trying, but it's not working. Uh, I'm gonna body slam into it. And oh my gosh, it's just open. Run. Quick, get out of here. What? No, taser, taser, though. Oh my gosh, I'm falling all the tasers. We gotta go back home. Oh no, 